so that's what I do when I start, and then we gotta get the camera ready. All right, boys and girls, it's uh, Saturday night. Uh, Saturday night, indeed. Unboxing seven. The thing about these unboxings, you just never know, like when this is gonna be the last one. I not as many as yesterday. I think we got a little bit less than yesterday. Um, I'm just wearing the glasses because I I like them. I think I look good, but I don't know how long they're gonna last. But a lot of girls are like, "Hey, you look in those glasses." So I always listen to Fair Sex. Uh, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? We got an unboxing seven. Quick couple quick things. A lot of people asking me about powder, the albino shark rainbow fish. He's grown quite a bit. He started this big. He's like this big now. He looks like one of these days I'm gonna wake up. He's just gonna be walking around the apartment with his dick hanging out, being like, This is my place now, son. Um, I did not put him in the tank with rained off because I thought that was a problem. Um those brownies that I didn't know what they were. I ate those. And I started feeling something funny, uh, sleeping. And then let's rewind today. During my pizza review, I got distracted and was trying to be on point, on character. Saw the brownies, the mysterious brownies, ate some then. And I am feeling it a little bit now. Uh, last piece of business before we start unboxing and doing this, that, the other thing. Um, that's a blade. Is... I, well, I literally have all these Swedish fish because I'm just, like, eating. And I did the sanitary thing. But that may be – yum. Let's get serious. These take too long to eat. Oh, look at this cup. Um, I got yelled at by my mother. Happy Passover, by the way. I literally ate so much fucking matzah because – I got, as the kids say, blazed. And then when I just plop down, I'm like trash everywhere. There's like this little pillow. There's just a fucking thing of matzah next to me. Unleavened bread. Just fucking hammering it like it was fucking drunk food. So dry. My mother had a Passover. This is not supposed to be public, so don't tell my mom that I said it. But she sent me a text, very serious. Um, and she's like, you're no longer allowed to eat any food during the unboxing she's like dead serious this isn't meant to be talked about don't say it on the unboxing don't tweet it don't uh fucking talk about it but like i'm dead serious you're in big trouble if you eat anything else so i don't know what to make of that that was that was after i had the brownie at lunch so i am since i don't know what like what do you mean people are gonna poison me or i'm gonna get corona my I, I think i've had corona three times beat it every time so i don't know I don't know. Can a 42-year-old kid, that's how old I am, get grounded by, like, their mother still? Because that's what it sounds like. It's happening. Like, you're, you're fucking, you're dead if you eat anything during. I'm a showman. If this is how I go out, eating brownies and Swedish fish and cake, I trust our crowd. Come on. I don't know what I'm going to do about that. She's dead serious. Let's start boxing. We got a whole pile over here. All right, let's just start boxing. And, oh, I'm going to be a lot faster on the marketing people. Like, the company's just doing the marketing. Some boxes, we're not opening pizzas on camera. They take too long. We'll still do the reviews, but we don't need to show them. We're just going to eat them. All right, I'm boxing. <laughs> Rona. Uh, some people say I'm going too slow. It's like if I go fast, this is a four-quarter game. You play till the end. You play to win the game. I ate so much weird food today. I think I got a weapon. Yep, little pocket blade, and we're off. And we're off. Is that nah? Ooh, these are fucking nice. I'm like addicted to the thought of just being like a weapon guy. You know why? That you know why I like this weapon. It duels as a knife like that. You can just cut close and really wound. Or if you're far away and I'm a fight and like someone's coming behind me and there's double weapons, pow, pow. That's a double death. Uh, double death. Thank you. All my weapons are there. Let's put the knives, everything. Hey, knife, come to the party. Welcome to the party, knife. Let's see what you made of. You're in the big leagues now, son. You got it? You got it, big leagues? All right. I think I see... 
Golf cover? Is that is that supposed to be like? Oh, what's it say? What? See? Fuck. Fuck you. Fuck you. It's a fuck you suit. I wonder if they're trying to sell me a fuck you suit. I can't wear these. I think this guy made me a fuck you suit or fuck you tie. Is he going to say fuck you? Here's a custom cover for the driver a, a, a couple days ago. Fuck COVID. All right. Fuck you cover. I'll take that. Um, I don't have my trash, trash, trash. Russell. Oh, I think we went across the pond. No, we didn't. Annapolis, Maryland. What is this? Oh, it's a shirt. It's a cocktail shirt. Uh, what size? Large? Mm, Got to go. Got to go medium. I'm a medium, and I'm feeling fat. A large will make me look even fatter. I almost threw that on. Um, cocktail. Tom Cruise. I'm, I, I don't, I've told you people that when I started Barcelona, I was going to do one of two things. All right? One of two. I was going to either uh, move to an island, serve margaritas, and play the steel drums, or start a business. I chose business. Oh, it's like they hurt me. A little Hawaiian. Is that a Hawaiian baseball or a bull? What is this? P&G, Pineapple Crossing. All right. Let's go. I'm going to be gross today. I haven't done any any exercise. I've just been eating. I've had eight Kit Kats, a whole pizza. I've just been eating like a motherfucker. So let's go. Oh, I had like a pound of matzah. You know what it is? It's that little thing. By the way, did people see that fucking dickhead from like Mediate? He's like, this guy's the worst person in the world because he wants to send all the wonderful pistachios or he said he won't even serve. No, I said I won't even serve wonderful pistachios to like people dying of Corona. Yeah, I wouldn't. That's an insult. To wonder, I, I'm not going to feed them those pistachios. That's giving up on him. He writes a real arc. Bro, you fucking dork. And he picks a picture of me, right? What am I doing? I'm high. Um, oh, baby. Oh, whoa. Um, <laughs> that fucking brownie, man. Uh, what was I talking about? Oh, that kid. And he uses a video where my fucking arms look fucking huge. It, it, like, that would have been, like, any photo I'd ever use from now on. Maybe where I'm wearing that bully shirt. This is going to be a long one because it's long. I, I don't know if it's professional or not to be on narcotics when you're doing an unboxing. Kid show. Shout out to that kid who was super excited. It's a kid show. They ask with narcotics is just be like... Uh, it's a chocolate chip cookie. Fudge, thank you so much for your order. Okay, so this, this someone said fudge, but not the fudge people. So I'm not going to eat that, Ma. If I don't know who it's from, then I won't eat it because I'm not a crazy person. Dopey me. What? Dope me? I don't know. That means what would people think I was, you know, I was tossing around the I Monet brand. I was tossing around the idea in my head of a halftime. Like if this thing's averaging three and a half, 20 minutes, let people get a shave, a shit, a shower in, whatever. Like you, all you little monkeys are all locked up with this again. They want to get a quick fuck in, come back, kid show, um, something like that. Let me like maybe rewind, recharge the battery, work out the. How do you open this? Work out the game plan. This is a tough open. What's Monet? Monet is an artist, isn't it? I don't think this is from the actual Monet. I don't like when things are hard to open. It makes me angry. I know my mom's watching right now, being like, David. Oh, David, you weren't supposed to say anything. It's a wallet? It's a weird wallet. Super weird. Cardboard. I don't know. What's that all about? Purple. Color of Kings. Royalty. Want to eat the Minnesota Vikings helmet when I was a kid. That's a fact. 
real fact. You guys are learning everything there is. I don't know why I thought, oh, yeah, I know why. I didn't know what was in there. I'm like, oh, are this going to get me? I didn't know what was going on in there. That scared me. I saw it. I'm like, I'm about to get fucking scuffed or something. World Wildlife Federation? Yeah, all right. This is a good dog toy. Scared the fucking bejesus out of me. Slippers. We got slippers. I, listen, I'm all in on slippers. I don't have any slippers. Here's a pair of handmade Italian slippers to get you through quarantine. All right. That's what I'm talking about. Um, Amba Scotia loungewear team. Team Port. This is a good gift. This is the nature of this game. All right. They write a letter with all my slogans. Somebody knows what we're talking about. The name of the company is there. They give me a nice pair of loafers. Italian. I've been to Italy. Have you? I was there before Corona. My dream vacation would be to go to Capri. I've never been there. Uh, Amalfi Coast. I didn't go there either. I'd like to go there. Now I've got Italian slippers. That's how this game is supposed to work. I don't throw stuff I want to keep over there. Nope. Gotta use, you got to use that braid. Been doing it eight days. The way back is the stuff I like. Oh, you know um, how we're doing the giveaway? Sending packages to people in need. Don't send any emails. We got 15,000 emails. 15,000 emails to unbox at Barstool Sports. We're going through them. I'm going to send out all this shit back to the people. Make Whipple Ball great again. Interesting. This shirt is for Andre the Giant. It's fucking huge, which is too bad because I would make wiffle ball great again. And it's where'd this guy come from? I was one of the greatest wiffle ball players in the history of Swamp Scott. No joke. We had to like reverse on the lefty. There's a like a Fenway, like a, a green monster. I would just take the pitch the other way. Gone. Couldn't couldn't get me out. Um, new package. You know, I can never ha tell how I'm doing in these. And when I say I'm doing, whether it's funny or interesting, I feel like I've been, like, pretty good for a high guy. Uh, Trolls Hockey. Okay. Eh, a little weird. Yeah. Let's see what we got. How do I open you? Trying to open it too. The YouTube stream, all they do is complain. Shout out to the YouTube people. Like my head's cut off. The packages aren't there. I, we can't make it fit both ways yet. I guess we again. I don't know. I'm doing the best I can. All right. It's a one man four hour show. Fucking every night. I'm bleeding. I'm out here bleeding. I go back to bed. It doesn't matter. Fucking who's the prettiest girl in the world? Who's the blonde in uh, Wolf of Wall Street? Uh, blonde in Wolf of Wall Street. Uh, goes to the Rangers games. What's her name? What's her name? Blonde. No one's going to tell me who this girl is. The bl I'm reading the comments. Blonde girl, Rangers fan, Wolf of Wall Street, kicks Leo's leg out. Margot Robbie. Bang. Thank you. Um, I don't care if Margot Robbie DM me and is like, hey, DM me back because I need to fuck this kid's show in the next five minutes. My hands are so beat up at the end of this, I couldn't reply. I'd just be like, I, I, I have to type with my nose. Nothing would get done. What is this? I have no idea who this is. In one sauce? I don't get it. Am I supposed to get it? I don't get what that is. In one sauce. I helped you there, YouTube. I watched over there to see if you could see what I could see. You're welcome. You're welcome. This is the same thing. I don't know what that is. Little uh, little island vibe here on this. Little island vibe. Trees. Green. Island. Red Sox. Tie-dye. That's going to be a pretty cool shirt that somebody gets. Like, I would wear that shirt. That's me being better than, bigger than my problems. 
Patriots, too. Both cool. Those are two sick shirts to be. What size is this? This is a medium. I'm wearing it. Large. Whatever. I'm fucking wearing it anyways. Fuck it. I'm taking it. That's mine now. I gave you the Red Sox one. And now I'm going uh, Red Sox. Patriots. Sweet hot. Told you. Told you. We, we going. We out here. That's that's another thing I picked up to make it myself sound. You know, we out here. I think that's what the kids use. You know, speaking of the kids, I check TikTok every once in a while. I don't know what the fuck's going on, on TikTok. I watch these dudes. They're like the most popular dudes there are. These guys look like kids who'd be stuck in lockers when I was growing up. Like, they're skinny. They dance weird. They'd be like the drama kids. It's like they've never fucking heard of a weak side blitz in their life. It's crazy. And they're like the cool kids. What do we got here? I'm not paying attention. And I feel like we got something a little sneaky sneak. Flatlander Farm. Passion for... I think we got a little of the green. I think we got a little bit of the green. Green machine. Green machine. Green machine. Uh, dicks. Li no, maybe not. Little little big cow company. Why does this feel weird? What's on my back? A spider? I was just saying that for at home. Everybody like, oh, he's no, but it, I felt like that thing. Um, my name is Grant Kunalov. Uh I'm a chief in the U.S. Navy. I want to send you a challenge coin that hopefully you will not put in your throwaway pile. Keep this in your pocket. If you're ever in a bar and hear coins tapping, make sure to take it out. Okay. Navy Chief Pride. How do I, how do I keep this in my pocket? It's huge. That sounds like a pretty sentimental thing, but how do you carry this around? It weighs like 10 pounds. I'm going to have to ask some of uh, our Zero Blog 30 people. It's not being thrown away, but I don't know what that means. How can I ever carry that? Secret Nature Artisan CBD. I don't believe it. Uh, I've said I want any more CBD. Too much CBD. Right. Now we're getting a little rhythm. What is this guy? I don't even know. Delmar Pizza. <laughs> Delmar Pizza. Delmar, Delaware. Best pizza shop on the shore. All right. One day we'll get out there. Best pizza shop on the shore, huh? Big words. Probably gets you killed in some parts on the shore. Everyone fights for their pizza. On the shore, I did Delmonico's. Is that the shore? <laughs> El Prez, the Bellas fucking love bars. Don't fucking love pizza. Love the Bellas. The Bellas. Okay. Thank you, Bellas. Keep going. I haven't lost my focus. We got uh, Knowledge Knowles Way. It's a little bunny. Live your life with an alien. I didn't see the alien coming on the back. Getting a lot of alien stuff in a cigar. The good, the good deed bead.com. Good and two two girls just hamming it up on the front. The good bead.com. Damn you, kind. All right, fuck that. Yeah, damn, I am kind. I don't know what this is. I think it's a charity, maybe. Thanks. Pass necklace to Mama Prez. Hey, Prez, we love your pizza reviews. Only thing getting us by. We are gooddeed.bead. Started in Jersey, founded by a college roommate. Brand that promotes random acts of kindness. Figure this necklace will make your eyes pop more than they already do. Love Jack and Lore. Nice little thing. I haven't, where's this necklace they speak so highly of? They want me to... I don't see a necklace. This? I mean, I can't wear this. This is a girl's necklace. Okay, B, do something nice. I think the moral of the story is be kind to your neighbor, right? Everyone love, happiness, peace. Unless they're an asshole, I do believe, I do believe 
paying for it, be nice to nice people. But if someone's a dick, you gotta you gotta return the dickness. I'm a big believer in that. You just don't be nice, be a dick too. Some people are like, oh, I, I have no room for hate. Oh, I got a lot of room for hate. I'm big in it. I I trade in hate. But be nice, pay it for it. I do both. Or you guys pay for it, and I'll take care of the other side. Hey, Prez, here's some swag for your first vacation post quarantine. Uh, lost travel. Too big. Didn't really like it to be either. I'm sorry. That one didn't go well for them, but I didn't. Not even close to the right size. I like having my thighs out when I wear uh, bathing suits. Makes me look taller. 5'10", that's my legit height for anybody wondering. 5'10 and a half if you want to be generous. I'm a lot closer to 5'10 and a half than I am uh, to 5'. What? I'm a lot closer to 5'10 and a half than I am to 9 and a half. I imagine being under. Oh, if you're under, what? I'm what? What was I saying? I'm a lot closer to being five eleven than I am five ten. Said it right that time. I don't like dealing with this box. And then I tried to look at YouTube to see if the YouTube people are right. I cut myself. Ooh, Teddy Ball Game? Yeah, Ted Ball Game. Teddy Ball Game poster right there. Put that in the art section. Right. The pack is falling out. That's. I don't know what's going on there. This guy looks like he's breakdancing. Bar falls. I guess he's falling off a bar stool. Okay. You gotta love the ideas that people come up with. I mean, that's just somebody had somebody had faith in it. Bar falls. Somebody's like, this will work. We got here, uh, Hey, Prez, sorry that your experience with Jackson left up to the standards for Midwestern hospitality and performance like a weak lip dick. Now you can wear your feeling on your sleeve with love from Wisconsin. What does that mean? Yeah, yeah, yes, yes. I like it. I like it a lot. Let's put that over there. This is a good pizza. You know, a lot of people are sending me pictures of fucking shells at Jack's. So what this says is Jack's weak, limp dick. No disrespect. And I don't mean any disrespect. Listen, I don't want people not buying Jack's because they're weak, limp dick, saucy, fucking gooey, no spine, no guts, no integrity pizza place. No disrespect to any of that. Buy it if you want. I, it's a tough economy. Buy their pizza. I'm just saying they have no guts and they're cocksuckers. They couldn't send one pizza. No disrespect, that's fucking dick. So I like this shirt. But no disrespect. And do buy the pizza. I don't want But if you're going to buy the pizza, buy the pizza. They should just make it right. Hey, Jax, assholes, do I have to fucking put it? I am the most forgiving human in the world. That's what they say. There goes Dave Portnoy walking on the street. Most forgiving human who ever lived. They say that. I hear it. I turn around. like, you're talking about me? They're like, yeah, you're the, you're the forgiving guy, right? Put a fucking pizza in a box with proper ice and just be like, that guy's having a bad day. He's a fucking cocksucker. No disrespect. I will do a Jack's review over again. It's not that hard. I'm so fucking forgiving. Until then, though, everyone's going to be able to at these fucking cocksuckers. No disrespect, but I mean, come on. It's not that hard. Stop swallowing your pride. You fucked up. You cocksucked it. Yeah, fuck Rona. We're just switching right off the bat. Let's keep it going. I fucking hate you too, Corona. You're a fucking... What type of enemy doesn't show their face? Like, is it a silent, like, oh, I'm Corona. I don't... You don't know how I travel. Like, come on. I got a million knives here. Let's just settle it like a fucking man, Corona, you fucking shitbags. I'm living in squalor. I keep saying it. I'm absolutely... 
Damn, you're kind. Thank you. Um, my house is squalid. There's no way for anybody to live, never mind somebody worth, like, Barstool Sports card pack. One pack, everybody. Rip and open? Rip and open? That sounds like someone wants me to rip and get glitter bombed. Rip and open? Glitter bomb? No, no. Okay, cards, cards. Tom Brady and Patriot guys. Wouldn't you just like to get Corona in a room? Well, this guy's like scary. No need for that. What are these just scary people? One bite. Everyone knows the rules. Just didn't knife these notebooks. Okay. Didn't really get that. But whatever. It's a thought that counts unless it sucks. Now, you know, it is the thought that counts, but thought, but you can still got to put thought in. Thought cannot count. Stash glass grinder. Oh, is this, I'm not great at making weed. I think this is when you get the bugs, you grind it up. A grinder, I'm going to have, <laughs> and a Kit Kat. That was maybe Rona. Um, I have to ask Buddha Ben about that. Big weed guy out on the West Coast. Shout out Buddha Ben. Guys, big weed guy. Oh, what do we got here? Fourth and long. It's a podcast read. Come on now, you're a competitor. I just got taken for a ride by fourth and long. Prez. Yo, Prez. From some green berets who like your pizza reviews, we thought you'd like uh, to review our MRI. We, I've already done the MRI pizza, I think. It's kind of the same. Yeah, I think he's about to say that. The freeze-dried, which is the same to the one I did. Uh, hopefully, this shitty piece is still better than those cocksuckers at DiGiorno. <laughs> it's not cocksuckers. Hey. Oh, DiGiorno. Hey. Oh. What is that song? Hey. Oh. Hey. You down with OBC? Yeah, you know me. I'm so bad at music. I pulled it together there. Um. No, the cocksuckers de Giorno just had terrible pizza when I had it. They're not cocksuckers. They're just not good at making pizza. Uh, the cocksuckers are jacks. Um, no disrespect. But anyway, it's from the Special Forces Operational Detachment Alpha. Yeah. Double deuce. Double fucking deuce. And on we go. The double deuce, also one of the great fictional bars of all time. Patrick Swayze. The best shape any man's ever been in in that movie, Patrick Swayze. Literally. Special forces, that's what I'm talking about. Now we're fucking going. Now we're fucking going. What is this? Oh, this is the gross pizza. But you got to put it in water and do all this shit. I've already done one of these um, with, the, with the military one that we have. Uh, There's a lot. I'm gonna, I feel like something... We'll just rip this the right way because it was so up in my face. I love fire shirts. I always say that. Daytona Beach, is that what that said? Yep, Daytona Beach. Daytona 500. Go there every year now. Let's get NASCAR back in the mix. Tommy Coupons. Dave Portnoy is the man. Are they trying to trick me with that? Like, hey, Tommy Coupons, Dave Portnoy is the man. And then it's going to be something. Oh, no. There's this a lot of shirts. Tommy Coupons, welcome to Liquidation Nation. Da -da -da. Randolph for vice president. What a cute little drawing of baby Randolph. I'll show that to him. He'll be very happy. Very happy. A lot of shirts. Yesterday there weren't all. Oh, it's an actual uh, Randolph shirt. <laughs> okay, look at that. What is that's just drawn on? It's just like a drawn on t shirt. We go from Alpha Force to, I think, what actually kind of looks like a dirty v neck. There's a chance, yeah, there's a chance this is game worn. I'm wearing someone's game worn fucking v neck right now. There's a really good possibility. Do I have to go rip some? I kind of do I look like a bra on you? What's going on? 
A little V-neck there. Oof. Oof. Huh. I wonder what's in this. Maybe it's a glitter bomb from Randolph Portnoy. Huh. Randolph Portnoy, who's my goldfish, who has no hands, has no access to the mail, or no bank account to send anything, sent me a package. Wait a minute, I already opened Randolph. Wait, what's just that? Oh, I punked myself. That was Randolph. I'm losing my mind. I'm losing my mind. I thought that wasn't open. I thought I heard the glitter. I'm like, oh, you're going to glitter bomb me? You think you outsmart me? Meanwhile, I'm wearing the dude's shirt. Huh. That's what happens when you do brownies that may or may not have marijuana in them before you do this. Your brain starts playing, playing, playing tricks. Kids show they don't need to know legal substance, Dave, in some states. My 360 giving shoes saving lives. Shoe companies fucking love to give shoes save lives, and they always kind of look like uh, – the shoes Kevin Malone wore at Jim and Pam's wedding, like tissue boxes. Like, no shit. Like, what? Let's save lives, but let's not pass these off of the shoes. I mean, like, honestly, it's like, uh, no, not that. I'm trying, I'm trying to make a joke, but it would basically be like, oh, I can't find one empty box around here. You're really going to do this, do me dirty like this. So I can't make a fucking joke. I can't use one. There's 9,000 boxes. I can't find a fucking box to make a joke. I literally can't find it. Whatever. Oh, I was going to say, what? This is a shoe now? I can't believe I couldn't find one box. What's this? Did I already open this? No. Rooster? What are you? Rooster mints, bad breath alert. Hope not. Just had an itchy nose. That's fine. I think I'm saying a lot of weird things tonight. Now, when I'm like, oh, I'm going good. Now I'm just off the rails a little bit. I'm going to have to regroup at the end of the hour. What is this? 50 Rockathon. See you, buddy. We want to be you. Glitter bomb. You just have to be watching none. Oh, I think I just, I, I just went one up on a box cutter. Check mark. Verified Twitter check mark. I told for everyone always like, hey, Dave, why don't you have a check mark on Twitter? Well, because I fucking told them to take their check mark and shove it up their fucking ass because they didn't give it to me when I deserved it. And then. I stormed Twitter headquarters and they had to walk, the police had to walk me out in San Francisco and they still won't give it to me. And it's like, fine, I never want it. And then they start giving it to everybody. Boom, check mark, okay, all these fucking losers, like eight followers and like they write for fake things. I'm over here with millions. I want you fucking, listen, if half my guys, if fucking Nate Dog is verified, I don't want to be verified. This sounds like something weird going on. Baseball cards? Oh, Jeff Bagwell. Great player for the Astros. I got anthrax. <laughs> I've got a lot of Jeff Bagwell cards. Great player for the Astros. Uh, famous batting stance. He was like big crouch, hands down, like up. And, and people love him. It, the people have been sending me the thing. That I, that, it's crazy. I don't know when Bagwell became so popular. How are we doing on time? Uh, 8.35. We doing good. We doing good. I think. All right. Everyone knows the FedEx boxes, for whatever reason, they tend to give me the most difficulty in the opening. This one that was a recipe for disaster in terms of me hurting my thumb. 
just the way the box was situated. Looks like a bobblehead of some sort. Palmeros. What is this? The pizza place. It's just a Palmeros Bango bobblehead. Almost just took something out. Priority. Oakmont Foods. Delicious, nutritious. Delicious and nutritious. My mom said I couldn't eat anything. I said, David, no more food. What is this? Is this like oh, organic carrot bolognese sauce? So these are like sauces for noodle? What is this kind? Organic essential. All right, it's just like tomato sauce. Honestly, don't send me it. It may be good, but that's just being a dick. Like it's a heavy package. No one gives a fuck. I'll eat it. I won't give you any more fucking bubble to see. It's the best thing in the world. We'll have a sales guy call you. What's this? Dave, try to open it. So Sauce. Mikey V's Spicy Reaper Pickles. I guess you get that image, which people like, of me holding it in front and be like, oh, Dave, what am I fucking endorsing my product? No, I didn't, homie. No, I did not. Just open and shit. Uh, go fuck yourself, literally. Ooh, a little banana fucking vibrator. And what is this? A cucumber vibrator. And a jalapeno vibrator. And uh, an eggplant vibrator. Ooh, and, and pizza pasties. And the chicken emoji. <laughs> oh, what that guy is. It's a little ducky, a little rubber ducky that plays with a little clitty clit. Orgasms. All right. Those are cute. Kid show. Spit. Got too excited. Spit. Sorry. Ears. Earmuffs. All right, these two are going to be tough ones to open. The irregular shapes are generally, those are a motherfucker. Why don't I open these beforehand? I don't have that answer. It's an answer that makes sense that one day I will get to the bottom of. But it's like that. That's a promise. I'll get to the bottom of why, why we wait. Oh, boy. Whoever made that is probably like that motherfucker. Spend all this time, he's just being a dick. Cut here, okay. It's tough to open either. Here we go. That's fucking awesome. That's fucking awesome. Made of metal. I have like a very nice art. This thing's fucking awesome. We have some very good items. You know how like players have like a jersey room? I could have like a homemade like Barca logo room. Another big boy from Jackie... Jerica, Chicago, Illinois. All right, Jackie, what is this, a wheel? What do we got here? wooden thing. There's a lot going on behind the scenes here. There's a lot. I'll try to pick it up so the people can see, but I don't really know how to do this. Ow! I do it for you. I do it for you. I should open this on the ground. I try to bring it up, and I stab myself in the stomach. I did that for you. When people say I don't lay it all on the line. I knew a, an unboxing show. If I'm unboxing where you can't see it, it loses a little bit of the appeal. 
So I unbox it in an unconventional position and stab myself. I gotta go down with this. But now that I made it such a stink about opening it on camera, I gotta keep I gotta keep trying to do it. Because that's what I do. I'm a man of my word, word of my man, promise big deliver big. High school quote for real, that's what it was. These art pieces are fucking Just want to present this gift to you. Token of my appreciation. Big fan from Chicago. That's it. No. Pretty fucking cool. And it's got the thing hanging and it's just a fan. That's why I opened it for you people. We have the best fucking fans in the world. Period. End of story. Like this is a real fucking deal thing. Fucking unbelievable. I'm touched. I'm deeply touched. Where'd the box cutter go? All right. Jeez. Maybe a bit off too much that I could chew right there. How are we doing on time? We're good. We're good. What is that from? Time, time. This thing will be over in five minutes. Top Gun. CV. Uh, Capital Vice? I don't know what that is. Capital Vice. What is this one? Oh, shit. I don't know. The shirts aren't bad. I don't know if they mean anything. I didn't know. Oh, we're fumbling, we're bumbling, stumbling. Two dead men on the... A Patriots pizza cutter. That's cool. Can't keep dropping like that. Motor boating son of a bitch. Pontoon. Uh, that's that song, Pontoon. Famous country band. Um, out on the pontoon, uh, floating, floating, pontoon, uh, song of the summer one summer, pontoon. Eh, what is this? Dave's Pizza, whoa, a homemade shirt, getting a couple, what does it say? Since 2013, Dave's Pizza Reviews, 100% real, floppy pizza, made, made with no spine, no backbone, no will to give people hope. I don't. I don't know if this guy's pro me or anti me, but I'm. I'm wearing it. It's kind of a funny shirt. It's, I don't like when people like fans come up with better shirts than like Welker, who's supposed to be selling our shirts and probably watches. Is like, oh, that's a good idea. But the thumb up his asshole. Kid show. Kid show. All right, let's bring in some here. Sometimes the fancy knives are more meant for human flesh than like plastic. Okay, pick the ones off the ground. Chop, chop, chop. I don't know if that's like for me or just stay on that somewhere. Easter shirt. Is this an Easter shirt? Moses? What is this? Looks like a Moses shirt. Box in a bag. We have a box in a bag. Now I'll have to just be a muscle man. 
Lots of paper, lots of card. Mississippi Mad, the life of Nelly. What? The knife. Follow me to Nelly's. Mississippi. The life of Nelly Jackson. And then, what is it? Just a bar. Check out the. Nope, won't do it. All right. Yeah, see, this thing was first had a night. We haven't had. What is that? I don't know what that is. Cape 15 lifestyle. Interesting. Kind of like the blue hat. Maybe it makes me pop a little bit. It's actually not a bad, bad looking sweatshirt. Not a bad combo. Those are some good ones. <laughs> Where'd that blue hat go? That's going to make my eyes look fucking spectacular. I must have thrown it. Those are the breaks. I think we have a glitter bomb here. Two glitter bombs foiled. I, the glitter bomb people either aren't paying attention or think you're going to fucking pull a glitter bomb. What is this? Just a fucking envelope? That Like, why put an envelope in an envelope? You know what I mean? Just send the envelope. Ooh, some scratch tickets to Dave. Uh, put heads for the top weekly market. We're lucky. Pen, uh, okay. How much are these? Two $20 scratch tickets. I'll do those at the break, maybe. I mean, we've got to see if I win, right? So when we come back, I'll do the scratch tickets. Oh, I, what is that? Wu Tan Clan 160? I'm due for a baseball hat. That don't really fit my head. Way too big for my head. Oh, I like it. I'm glad I put it on. This is the fire department in New York. These guys, who makes the fucking logos for these guys? They're all unbelievable. Let's make this hat a little bit tighter so it fits since this is the hat of choice here as we head into the end of uh, the first hour. It's probably going to be a three-hour three hour deal. Buckle that shit up. Put a blanket on the kids. Put a fire, a log on the fire, all that shit. What is this? Uh, Oppo. Just a purple Oppo. Steel Minnesota heat, but not my hood. I don't know what that means. This one has an interesting stench to it. Like it's uh, like a factory sense. Like it's also wrapped kind of funny. I don't know what we're dealing with here. All right. Sauce. Yeah, sauce. Sauces aren't going to do it. Rubs, barbecue, all that like that. You're just not going to get any shine. No point to send it. You're wasting money. Antics. This sweatshirt is like kind of hipster and kind of cool. Like if you just wear this around, it says antics on it with a fucking strike through symbol. It's like, all right, that's fucked up. I don't know what that guy's up to, but it can't be good. I like it. I don't know where this shirt came from. It's just sitting. Oh, it's also antics. What, are they fucking go on the subway and, like, just do antics? Like, hey, old person, get out of your seat or also fucking trip you. Is that an antic? I don't know. <laughs> Time, we're good. What is this? What is this? Nasal soreness. What are you saying? I got a big nose? Fuck that. It's my trademark. Who's the guy? Uh, oh, I almost threw away a, a knife. Who, Adrian Brody. That guy gets all the chicks. I'm 100% better looking than that guy is. Way more culture, too. What's going on here? Freezy flex? So just ice cubes that freeze. Actually, we can use those because our freezer situation is at the limit. Take it to the limit. Take it to the limit. One more time. Ball stuff, I believe. Long jong. This is just probably for a big old dick. So I'll put that for somebody else pile. Um, the Eagles take it to the limit. That's what I was doing. Uh, anthrax. Ah, bleh, bleh, the worst. Wonderful pistachios. Again, door. Hello. All right, you can just leave it downstairs. Thanks. Nothing against wonderful pistachios. They just stink, and they're a disgrace to the pistachio game. Beginner's Guide to the Stock Market. Like, I need a beginner's guide, dude. I'm way past beginner level. Uh, community. Love. 
Community, joint community. Hey, everyone's in together. Stay the fuck inside. There it is. Stay inside, people. What is this? I can't see what this says. I decided this package was so good, I sent it UPS on a Saturday. Kind of building it up right here. Endless summer. Okay, I mean, it's not that good. It's just fucking shorts and whatnot. I do like the pina colada thing. Yeah, I mean, they're cool shorts. I don't know that they're that. What size is this? Is this medium or large? Large. Well, I'll keep one, maybe. I like the pink. Pink will bring out my color when I get a nice tan. My head, it just, there's certain hats that I can't pull off. And, like, this is kind of one of them. Uh, where are we at for time? 8.51. Why don't we do this? Why don't I... Why don't I hit end? We come right back. I got to get like a coin and do some scratch tickets and see if we all became rich. Or in my case, richer and everyone else watched me get richer. So, um, but that's just how it goes if I'm the one with the, I'll donate. How about that? I'll donate and like match anything I win. This guy, the heart, pop, 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 pop. We'll be right back. We out here, are we back? Scratch tickets. I'm just gonna get going. There's not gonna be no way for you to see it. So went up to uh what I gotta do. Match any of your numbers to any of the winning numbers and win. All right, let's go really quick. Because I know you can't see it. But I have matched to donate whatever I win. First card. Any of the numbers, three. I can actually I don't know what I got yet. I think all losers there. 42? No. This game doesn't work. This game doesn't work. I'll let you know on the other one. I know good TV and bad TV. That was bad TV. Read letter first. This is a glitter bomb. So I think they're trying to trick me. It's a pickle. CBD roll on. They were trying to trick me to get me to talk about it because they know I don't do CBD. A lot of little guys today. I like the little guys. I can slice and dice my, my way right through them. This is a bear. Things have fallen. Those could be tomorrow. If I don't pick them up quick, they'll just get lost in the... Um, Kyla and CJ, here's the hat for my small business. Old Glory Boiler Merch Line. I can't wear that hat either. It's a good-looking hat, but I can't wear it. It doesn't fit my head. The big ones, the big brims just don't. Not a lot of candy, which is good, because I don't want to get tempted after my mom yelled at me. This could be a weapon or candy. Oh, baby. I think it... these are just tight. I have everything now. I like this because I can go like this. That's like a siren. I'm like, okay, you want to fuck all of that? Boom, boom, boom. That's like sharpening it up. You got a problem with me? You got a problem with me? No more problem. I guarantee you that 88 and out the gate. Tough to find me new weapons I don't have, but people are doing it. Goat USA. I think I met these guys before. I think I know who these fucking goat people are, and I feel like I met them. This looks like North Carolina colors, to be honest. It's kind of cool. 
Goat USA. What's this? Kitchen edge grip. Knife sharpener. Ooh, good gift. I need a knife sharpener. Keep all my weapons on point. Wouldn't want to, like, you know, think I have the upper hand and then a weapon does not work at all. Uh, perfect point throwing knives. Ooh. I love when people are like, oh, you're scared of Corona? This Corona's scared of me, dude. I have so many weapons. And these look like knives I can throw into somebody's skull. And the way they're packaged make me think they don't just go into your skull. They go into your skull. Yeah, they do. Fuck. They're like... Bing! Do you shoot them or you throw them? Between this and my Chinese stars, I'm going to be able... You name it, I wish I had one of Khaleesi's dragons to just... Like, have all my weapons and throw fucking knives at people. Gloves. El Prez. Luxury. We are a luxury streetwear fan. Again, not knowing much about marketing, but this packaging, just a black, like, trash bag, doesn't scream luxury at all. Unless I'm getting punked. But how can you say you're a luxury brand and send something in trash? Live for. Okay. Weird. Is that the name of it, I wonder? Titleist Golf Balls. Glen Oaks Golf Club. A goat head. A horse's head. They probably want me to put the horse's head on. But it's like in a package. My mother's telling me not to get Corona. I just didn't feel like taking it out. It wasn't an easy takeout. It was just Nella. Nella. Window service. Nella window service. Uh, these are sweatshirts I like. Weirdly, like a girl rolling around in like sweats and like an industrial sweatshirt. Kind of turn on. Don't know why. It's just primal. This is a shirt, a Christmas shirt, pizza shirt, Godzilla on a pizza. What is this shirt? This is, so it's Santa Claus riding a, Santa Claus riding a dragon on a pizza. That's be it put on. Even on Passover, I know, but that shirt, like, I mean, this is maybe the craziest shirt I've ever seen. What is going on in this shirt? Oh, it's tight, too. I mean, this is a one in... <laughs> this is a fucking one in bazillion shirt right here. I don't even know what to say about this shirt. It's kind of like brighty and like... This is... If somebody wears this shirt into the party and they're remotely good looking, it's like wearing a cowboy hat. It's like that guy knows he can fuck. If you're gross and like Seth Rogen in that movie with uh, the other guy, uh, McLovin. What, what kind of name is McLovin? Um, what's the name of that movie? Uh, not American Pie. Uh, super bad. Super bad. If you're like Seth Rogen and Super Bad, you wear this, you're a joke. If you're a good looking dude and you can pup your fucking pectorals like that, you're confident in your fucking dick game. Wait for the next hat, I guess. I change those rules on the reg. I never have water over here. It's a huge error every time. I'm, very, I'm quite thirsty. Quite thirsty. <clears throat> Papayo Bowl fantasy football loser. Uh, trophy. I, I don't I don't get it. Dave don't get it. 
Oh, I did not lose that other scratch ticket, but maybe two. I put, no, I maybe put it over there. Amarillo Sod Poodles. What a name. What is this, a team somewhere? Is that a real team? Beer Baseball. That's kind of a cool shirt. Someone's going to get a cool shirt right there. Beer Baseball. There's going to be a lot of cool care packages going out. Public <laughs> Supermarket. Publix. We're getting a Publix fucking sweatshirt. Uh, mask, socks, Tiger King. <clears throat> Social Standard Athletics. What is this? Global Standard. Anthrax. Up in my dick. Kids show. Maxery. What is a Maxery? World's smallest knife. This is a knife. So I thought it's the world's smallest knife. Is this just a little, yeah, it's a little pocket knife. Look at this. This is if you're like fake and you want to be like friends with somebody and you have a little knife in your hand. They cut their hand. They go to look at their hand. You come back with a machete or the jugular. It's combat one on one, if we're being honest. My eyes are a little red, a little color today, probably. Uh, tripod thing. And so my, my eyes are so sensitive to the sun now. They turn red in like a fucking Versace. A little Vers That's not Versace. That's Versace. There's Versace matches. All right. Refrigerator upon. I think we got a glitter bomb in the house. Happy quarantine, Prez. This is not a glitter bomb. It's something clearly meant to be like a prank, and I'm sure it is a prank, but it's not a glitter bomb. Something you can hear the springs. It's gonna. It's, this is designed to spring out. And, ah, it's probably like a big fucking dick. Think it's a dick? I'm gonna guess dick in the face. They make. Come on. I was half right. They're dicks. They're glitter dicks. I shouldn't have opened it. That, that did a pretty good job of making me think it wasn't 100% that. I knew I knew dick was involved, but I, I didn't know they were being glitter dicks. But glitter dicks are way easier to pick up than the other confetti. That's, like, not that bad. The little fucking glitter shit, that's a whole different can of worms. You're on your hands and knees picking that shit up. It's in your food. It's in your hair. It's everywhere. By the way, quick update. That lobster that I bought yesterday, then I'm like, oh, this thing's dead. That was very much alive. We gave it to the FedEx guy who's cooking up a nice fucking dinner with it. Drinks. Coffee. Fuck you, coffee. I love coffee, but the coffee ship has sailed. And yeah, I don't want packages anymore. So stop sending them. Nope. Drinks we do not open. That ship has sailed. We're trying to get this down to only like legitimate, creative, funny, whatever it may be. Just send in a, a four-pack of drink for a shout-out, not it. Thanks, big laughs. Uh, Barstow love the pizza review. Massachusetts pure maple syrup. Like, I can live with that. You know, Massachusetts. Woo! Fast as fucking lightning. His hands were fast as lightning. Do -do 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 -do. Everyone's kung fu fighting. Do -do 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 -do. If I had that lady over there, she could have fucking sung a cappella on that. But that's just a, you know, pancakes. How do people feel about pancakes? Pancakes for me, all time, and I mean all time, like two bites and I'm sick of it. Like, oh, I love it after one bite. It's almost like 
a poor man's candy corn. Like, I always think I want them. I always love the smell. But if I'm done with one pancake, I'm like, all right, I had enough pancakes. So, but that syrup will last me forever on the bright side. Also, I don't think pancakes have ever been made in this apartment, nor really anything ever made in this apartment. Yup. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. This is just old school shit, boys. The old school. This The cool factor in the unboxing seven, uh, I need some hand sanitizer, is about to get put up about, oh, vicious paper cut. Oh, I didn't get it. I put the, I put the serum in it. Stung like a fucking banshee. Holy, the things I do for content, the things I do for you. Tell your friends, be like, tune in. This this guy is bleeding out here for us. He's bleeding. He's leaving all on the line. He's done a one man. He's done at least a three hour one man show seven days straight. Just laying it out on the line for the internet. And he's about to turn into the coolest motherfucker there is. Fuck right. Let's fucking go. I don't condone smoking. Never had a real cigarette in my life. But candy cigarettes, whole different ball game. What do we got here? Donald Pump. Somebody will want that. I need my I need that jean jacket back. Dildo? No. Groove it. The wet club scrub. Golf clubs. You got a problem with me? You got a problem with me? My muscles looking big lately. You got a problem with me? Huh? What's up, Holmes? Fucking so cool. Abington, oh shit! All right, so Abington Town family, loving memory, Daniel Vasilian, sad story. Sixth annual Sergeant Daniel Vasilian Road Race, which we'd like to get involved. I think we have been involved in this. I grew, uh, I didn't grow up, but uh, Renee and I, we lived in Abington like five years. Little story about Abington. Blog starting right. I lived on a little side street in Abington. And I didn't think I was really reading the blog, but I complained about how bad the plow service was during a snowstorm. Next snowstorm, all the plows came and just fucking plowed me in for like two months straight. Learned my lesson. Don't talk about the plow company. We need gifts. We need gifts. And here we go. How many girls right now are like, oh my god, dude, looks so fucking cool with a cigarette in his mouth. What a badass. I know probably fucking a lot of them. Think about cigarettes, though, they're bad for you. Cigar the corona probably comes right at it. Tough to talk to and do this with it in the mouth, which is a problem. May have to eat it. I don't think my mom's going to like this. For, uh, I consider myself like really smart. I do. Not a great two at once guy. Like eating that cigarette was taken away from everything else I was doing. Chocolate brownie probably didn't help. All right. Dildo. We got yo. We got ourselves a dildo. Dickbrush.com. <laughs> this is a real thing. I'm trying to sell like a zillion of these dildos. Dickbrush.bigcartel.com. You're in the market for a dildo. The guy's trying to sell dildos. Oh, it's a toothbrush. I didn't even fucking see that. So you brush your teeth with like a dick. Not my scene, babe. Imagine if you like went over a girl's house and that was her toothbrush. Are you happy or mad about that? You know you got like a freakazoid, but. You probably already like have somebody else's fluids in you. One of these hats. Kind of cool. I'm in on it. Whiskey Pines National. I 
I feel like the initial hats have been a big hit for me. Seems like a nice golf course, too. A lot of hats. Where is it? Whiskey Pines. That's a cool shirt. It's a cool shirt. I don't know where that is. Never said it. How's the hat? Oh, yeah. Fucking right, Dave. Um, this is Pac-Man hugging himself. Very hipster vibe. If I just didn't put on a new hat, I would do it. What is it? Bill's Mafia? No. B. Oh, Boyle? Boyle? Oh, is this the, the hockey player from... What is this? Boyle? En no, it's just Boyle Energy. This is a Boyle Energy. <laughs> That's kind of a fucking fire hat, isn't it? Boyle Energy. I actually put that into the Dave Portnoy keep side. If I ever want to feel like I'm in Brooklyn or something with all the fucking hipsters, I'll wear that fucking hat. Two pairs of scissors. Love it because I always lose scissors. Thank you. Nice. I can never have enough tools of the trade. Yeah, a man... Uh, a man is only as good as his tools. A famous fucking uh, architect once said that. Oh, this smells. Thanks, Dave. Dry ice. Many thanks. What do we got? Thanks for so much support for the little guys. Fam in Chicago Thin Crust, Spinato's Pizza. I think I already have a, a Spinato's in the uh, oven. I mean, in the freezer. I'm going to try to carry them all over. I couldn't do it. Not enough hands. Humans were only born with two hands. I can only use what God gave us. If I had more hands, I'd have more packages. But I don't. Anthrax packaging. Oh, big time anthrax packaging. Ah, oh, gross. You've already sent. Look at, look, look, look at this package. It's a disgraceful package. Michigan. Oh, this is an Ohio State shirt giving Michigan the bird. Actually, pretty creative. Surprisingly th creative from all the dummies who go to Columbus. That had to be like a Michigan man who's just making money on Michigan on Ohio State fans. I don't think anybody at Ohio State's smart enough to come up with that. Corn on the cob holder, love it. Everyone knows if you've been watching this that nobody loves the corn people more than I do. Some sort of trophy. Dave, U.S. Open champion. Don't hate that. Bang. Um, and that's good. Emergency charger. Okay. Some sort of mug. We got a mug. Grip tens. Get a grip. This guy is. This is pack cut here. Oh, this thing was freaking me out. I thought it, I thought it was something on me for a second. Let's get that out of the way. Great cut. That was a great cut. Hall of Fame cut, I think. Oh, maybe not. The big knife here. What? Big knife here. Is there a big knife in here? Was it? What am I dealing with here? Big knife here. What is this? No, this is art. Ooh. Oh, I can smell it. It's... It's art. We're dealing with art. This is going to go into the gallery. Art is always the hardest to open. Oh, this thing smells like it's fresh off a wood pine. Like heavy smells. Oh, 
Oh, that's cool. Nope. I need more work down low. Don't leave. I'm just right here, everybody. I'm just below the belt. I'm just below below starboard here getting this thing out. We'll be out in a minute. I'm still here. Still here. That could be a whole, you know how people are doing all these drinking games now? Another category be like, how long does it take Dave to get art out of the thing? Because art is kicking my dick all over the ring. It is not easy to get art unglued. I mean, art, this is like a wrestling match. This is That was better than WrestleMania right there. Do you see it? Very cool. It's like my name on Barstool. I don't know how easy. Art. I like that art. I can't have that art in my apartment. I can't have, I can't have pictures of my face in my own apartment. Can't do it. Prez, plastic straws are bad for the environment and paper straws. Here's some glass straws that make great alternatives. I'm all in glass straws. Someone already sent me. Wait, wait these, oh, these aren't these aren't glass. I don't know what those are. They may those may be good for the environment, but they stink. already opened that one or something. That must have been like some sort of fucking magic trick. I don't know. Please handle care glass. Okay. All right. I, I see you. Handle care glass. What does that mean? Drink? What does that mean? Thanks for doing this. We are all big fans of Pizza You Stay safe. I'll stay safe. What is this? J.D. Gourmet Special Reserve Barreled Balsamic Vinaigrette. I'm starting to get a lot of balsamic vinaigrettes and olive oils to the point those may start getting the no-go because I have nowhere to put them. No. That was like drink protein coffee. I think that was a coffee protein soda. <clears throat> Choking, but I'm coming back. Uh, what is this? The Mammoth Park. Oh, the racetrack. <laughs> this is fucking sick. A Bob Baffert fucking autograph thing. Bobby Baffert. Well, I don't even know what this is. Like a softball shirt? Fuck right. I feel like I could fucking go yard in this thing in a second. Look at this fucking thing. This, <laughs> this shirt's fucking fire. That a boy. Now we're feeling athletic. Come on, bring it inside, bro. See what happens. Fast hands and don't have shields. Some cookies. Mom said can't eat them. Sorry. Mom said cannot eat food. David, stop eating food, she said. What do we got? Perfume inspired by Gucci Guilty. Does that mean like inspired by the real Gucci? It's just knockoff Gucci? No, thanks. Amazon fulfillment services. People are like, you know, Amazon has Corona, right? Yeah, I know. I wash my hands. Drinks. Rally up. I, it's incredible, right? I, it, the amount of money that drink companies waste when you're just going to send a drink I've never heard of. No, like, tie into Barstool, just like, hey, here's drinks. No brains on those marketing teams. Rally. 
puke and rally? Is that what we're dealing with? Because it came with a little shock. Get rally US. What is this? Say goodbye. This is not a well packed gift at all. Um, I don't know how you get like something like that across quickly. I think you gotta like do a trick gift and then be like, now oh, I got your attention with something. I don't know. Sweatpants, those. What? I don't know what this is. Not caught my attention though. What is it? Sweatpant, those man? I have no idea what that means. They're not bad hats, but I don't know what it means. And I don't know if I put it on, whether that, like, I just became part of, like, I don't know, like the Nazi regime or something. I have no idea what this means. Dream worn sports. Okay. This is shorts. Lunar steel. Weird. This looks like it. it should be easy to open. FedEx always though tricks. It's like they're they don't leave enough room to slice. That's what it is. It's like very fine. Like everything you gotta be on point with FedEx. What is this? Baseball bat? Yep. Sting it. Stinger wood bats. Now, is this going to be custom to me, you think? Or is it just like, oh, here's a bat. Whoop. All right. See, I can. This is what you have to do. I was like, what do, what do they do? Is this going to be a bat? But they, they, they customize it. One bat. Everyone knows the rules. El Prez with the logo. So there you go. That's it. Now I'll take it. And I'm already wearing the softball shirt. And this bat feels like the sweet spots, the size of a moon. And you come inside. It looks like I can't handle it. I turn and I hit it fucking 480 on a P-rod down the line. And the entire world is gooing and gasping. And I'm just fucking trotting. That's why I put my name on the bat. I was, by the way, I used a 32 in high school. Yeah, 32. I like I, I I made up for the small bat with the quick hands. Chili. Wait. Skyline chili. Famous chili, obviously. So that's just good something to have. I that's how famous skyline is. I'm like, chili, why would you send chili? I'm like, wait a minute, half the skyline. Porsche marketplace? I kind of don't hate that hat. It's like if you're fucking around with a Porsche marketplace, that's like kind of like wearing a Rolex. It's like, oh, this guy just fucking shops at the Porsche marketplace. Big hat, though. See? Boom. On the front. I'm, you know what? You know what, Porsche marketplace? You're out. This hat looks so much better than me. Those are cool. Are these the same fucking hat? How, that hat I would have thought would have fit me. But I thought wrong. I thought wrong. Both in the pile. All right. What's this say? El Prez, you probably have yet received any package this international. This one comes from the middle of the world in Ecuador, where your fan base of three people is growing faster than Corona. Little Ecuadorian flag. Fuck Jax. No disrespect. Fuck, I like these Ecuadorians. What's the national anthem of Ecuador? It's got to be something like, dun, 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 like fast, upbeat, and Ecuadorian. What are these people of Ecuador? There's the best tonic water in the world. The, oh, it, 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 it's from the Cinque, Te Cinque Tana team. So I'm giving them an ad, but they got me, see? They at least followed the story. Instead of just sending a water, they gave me this whole story on Cinque Chena, the Ecuadorian national anthem, how we're growing faster than Corona in Ecuador. How if I went to Ecuador, I could conquer it, become king in two seconds. And now I'm pushing their agua tonic like it's the best thing in the world. That's how you play the game. It's a dance. It's a dance of seduction, you know? 
Speaking of dancing, I once took ballroom dancing classes and lesson because I'm so bad. And all they told me to do to learn how to dance is act like I was shoveling snow. Just act like you're shoveling snow. Shovel snow. Shovel snow. That was the move. I still will break it out time to time. The up and coming monopoly of maple syrup. Maple syrup. Maple cotton candy. These maple sugar. My mom said I couldn't eat it. Kind of like that. That's a fucking a fire shirt. If you're a medium, you're coming with me, son. Large. That means it goes to the people. Please don't ask me. Yes, nicely. I won't ask you. That's fine. That's how it goes. You asked not to be asked. I asked. I won't ask. Our question, our quarantine hero, well pressed. Thanks for the night uh, entertainment. Here's I don't want no part of this fucking hombre to hang on your wall. P.S. Fuck Jax. Listen, Jax is taking an absolute beating in the streets. Hey, Jax, just man up. Come back. It's like, it's like Don Corleone. What have you done to treat me with disrespect? I'll be nice. Just come back and be like, we fucked up. We should instead of telling everything we couldn't do, we should have told you why we could. I how good is this? I haven't seen it yet. <laughs> Fuck man. I don't know. <laughs> that look like me. Does it? Hold on, hold on. Yeah. Also, I almost didn't do this because this hat company, why well, I love this hat, they put me in their fucking ad, like targeted ads. They're using me as a spokesman. That's fucking illegal. And I got to deal with all our people, our fucking, you know, you're going to get the whole fucking, this guy will get it all shit down. Either fucking just put a picture of me wearing it, which is fine. I'm wearing it. You can do that. But you can't do targeted ads because then our lawyers get this like there. You, you can't use me as your company fucking spokesman. All right. So don't be a dickhead. In fact, I'm going to take that hat off because I know they're running me as their spokesman. One bite, everybody knows the rules. Perfect. I knew I didn't need that hat because I had this coming up next. No brainer. Look at that. Done. Easy. One bite. Oh, it's like a card. I handmade these kitty ears. Would love it if you could wear them during a pizza review. Little as this girl. No, I'm doing one better than that. I'm wearing the fuck out of them right now on national live TV slash internet. In front of, we only get 23,000 people. This is the lowest one. I thought, now I feel like I'm going to cry. I should take these off and stop this fucking stream. Close a copy of my resume. Eh. Hope you are staying safe and healthy. Brittany Foreman. We run our course, 23,000, huh? It's not good. It's a lot of work for only 23,000. Um, tell Frankie we still want to bring the pizza truck in and tuck it. Barbone. This hat's cool too, but I don't think it's going to fit. It's so fucking big. I think I did the Barbone uh, on island, but not the real way. It's a cool fucking hat. Too, short, too small. What? Is, by the way. What is this hat runs? Eh, what is homemade? What do you mean? You oh, it, it had a logo. Is that what she means by homemade? Starting to make some progress. Do we just lose people? People have no interest. Am I not funny tonight? Am I babbling? Do I think I'm funny and it's like I'm just high, or is it just this thing's running its course because it's a lot of work to do not have the biggest fucking live stream in the world? Barstool Sports, more art. Welcome to the gallery, homie. 
Welcome to the gallery. Uh, this looks like some fish company. Casa Vieja Lodge, Guatemala. One ton of mara, one eat a guan. Corona sucks. Yeah, Corona does suck. One eat a guan. One eat a guan. One eat a guan. Yeah, this is a lodge in Guatemala. Huh. Well, all right. Let's keep the hat line moving. I'll fucking go to Guatemala. Where the fuck's Guatemala? South America? I don't think I've ever been. Oh, I've been to Mexico. I'll fucking go. I'll, I'll go right in your face to Guatemala like you read about. Think I won't go? You think I won't go to Guatemala, son? With some cool fucking fishing shirts? Deep sea fishing? I'll go Guatemala right in your face all day long. Bump, bump, bump. McBride's Pub, Providence, Rhode Island. On the clock. On the clock. Sweatshirt, McBride's Pub. Nice stool sticker there. Let's see what we got. All right. We're, we're moving. We're shaking. We're baking. We got a package within a package and some sort of big letter. Prime time signatures. Come uh, start my memorabilia company similar to Hugh Bar. So we're getting there. Here's a token of appreciation for getting us through quarantine. Oh, that's fucking sick. Assign Michael Scott. You know, I always wonder does he sign this Michael Scott or Steve Corrupt? I ask people, humble brag. I have done this door. Hello? Oh, you can leave it downstairs. Whole Foods? I don't pick anything up. I always wonder, uh, does he sign it? It looks like he signed it. Steve Carell. Or do you sign it Michael Scott? Like, what would you... I'd rather him sign it, I think, Michael Scott. I'm assuming this is Carell because of the big C. But I'd rather him sign it, Michael Scott. Yee apparel. Who's ordering Whole Foods downstairs? It's ridiculous. It's just such a waste. Yee clothing. Nice quality shirt. Yee life. Yee. Yee. What's it, a gun company? Looks like a gun company. At least there's guns on the box. I mean, we're doing good. It should be about a three hour. I'd say we got about like. Eh, we got a lot of work to do, boys. We got a lot of work to do today still. Is this going to be a knife of some sort? Nunchucks? Nunchucks. These don't seem like pussy nunchucks, to be honest. These are the cheap kind. Like, I have the real nun. Yeah, these. If if my real nunchucks hit these nunchucks, these nunchucks would fucking break in a second. Like, this is pussy nunchucks. You almost encourage an enemy with those. And it's almost disrespectful to send to somebody with so many weapons. Band-Aid. Oh, Frozen. I love these two. Love these two gals. Day trading. They're just badass. Especially Elsa. I try to I would try to wifey up Elsa in real life. If I well in real life, I mean if I was in that world. I don't know if I'd be able to do it. She's a wild one. All right, more fake nunchucks. It's weird how that happens. What is this? Broad Street, Broad Street Hooligans, Philadelphia. It's a cool shirt. That's a cool shirt. I mean, I am. I, you're not going to get me to put it on, but I am the captain of Philadelphia. I can't just be wearing. I wear like a Kevin Hayes shirt and a Bryce Harper shirt. That's about it. Hands are so fucking dry. Is there still lotion anywhere? I think there is. I just don't know. Here we go. Here we go. Hand lotion. Needed it, had to have it at that point. 
Hey, Prez, enjoy watching the unboxing. Hope you enjoy this badass gift. <clears throat> Another in. Yep. Chinese stars. <clears throat> Haven't started to lose my voice. Current tides. Glasses. Late rumbles. How is this? What is this? A knife? What is this? What is that? A knife? An opener? What is it? Hello? You push it? What is this? Looks like a knife or a corkscrew. Oh, I think I just sliced my fucking hand. I don't even want to look. No, I did. Wide open. Oh. 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 I'm all right, but I'm cut. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. The weapons finally got me.
Well, that that was unfortunate. Uh, yeah. So I had to go do urgent, urgent care because I fucking sliced my finger apart. And I obviously, I mean, I, I this thing it should be fucking, it just took half my finger with it. Now, am I going to cry about it? Yeah. I'm going to fucking cry about it. I'm going to cry in front of you. Did I cry a little bit off camera? Is I like, I'm going to, my mom's going to fucking be in my asshole. Do I, you know, I don't know. Was it because I put the cream on? So it's loose. Here's what happened. I yanked it out. This thing is the sharpest thing I've ever encountered. And it just sliced my finger apart. I had, it just went. And at first it was almost a delayed reaction. And then I looked and I knew I was in deep water over there. Instantly, I knew I was in deep water. I knew, I it, I knew, like this is no joke. Ironically, I've had a lot of reactions that have been like more pronounced, where I thought something happened. This one, it was like, Shh. and then like a second later, I'm like, I I think if you rewind the tape, I'm like, I think I sliced my finger open. I looked, and I knew we were in deep. I knew I I knew I was sinking. Uh, I couldn't get to stop bleeding. That's why I had to go down there. I had to get all the band-aids. I had to wrap it a little bit. It was I couldn't stop. Did he almost lose me? Did we almost have the first death in the history of unboxing? Yep. Yep. Because I don't like blood. This thing, it, shame on you. Because I'm pulling it like it should be a nice, easy out. It's not. Like, I'm not going to do it again. But if you don't come out easily, you're just asking for someone... I went like that. <sighs> the show must go on. That is why I came back. If you don't think I was sitting there in my bathroom, blood gushing, going through band-aids, fucking just trying to get a stop, trying to make sure Corona, I could hear like, you know, when you hear like rats running, they Corona smells blood. And like he's cut, he's cut. How do we get in his blood? I They were doing that. I could hear it. If you don't think it's in the bathroom, which is sort of quarantine. I was just trying to get all the corona out of the cut, sterilize it. And I don't and I'm like, should I come back? Because I don't even know this finger is useless. And I said, I have to come back. Because that's what guys like me do. They come back. They come back. It's not how hard you get knocked down, it's whether you get up. So yeah, I lost half my finger there. And it hurt. And it's gonna hurt. And it probably will never grow back because it's also like right where you bend your finger. I'm probably dealing with that cut. Till I die. But I came back and I want all the kids out there to think about that. The little kids and the Joes, all the kids who are like, oh, everyone gets a trophy. Society. Things don't go your way. You don't quit. You don't go to mom and dad. You don't complain. You bandage it up. You get back out there. You don't make excuses. You open the next box. Take that, put it on a fucking postcard, print it, seal it, send it. That's a motto. It's going to be a lot tougher to cut, though. And by the way, you know it's bad when I didn't come back and show it to you because it was bleeding too profusely. I was worried about losing too much blood. I mean, now it's I'm severely handicapped. Is this DGT Global? Now my pinky is getting too involved. Like I'm not using hands that I usually use. I don't know what this is. This is probably another weapon. I'm under attack from weapons now. No, it's a puzzle. It's a wave. It's tsunami. I don't know what that is. I have no idea what that is. None. Dave Portnoy has no idea what that is. Oh. I'm going to fucking hear it from my mother. No more weapons. Brick by brick. I really wish I didn't get attacked by my own weapons. That's how weather, but yeah, that's like Toy Story. Weapons start being like, oh, maybe he's not our master. Maybe we're his master and we can attack him. Maybe. I don't know. World gets. What is this? Smells really strange. Mr. Brickster. <clears throat> Mr. Brickster. 
Oh, that's why it's a brick. It has nothing to do with me. I don't think. Maybe it does. We'll see. Built like a brick. Brick by piece by piece, brick by brick. We're better together. Who is this fucking guy? No idea. Yeah, I slowed it down. I know. Buckle up. What do you want me to say? Uh, we had a major injury that I'm sure all those little fucking punks who open toys on YouTube, like that kid who has like a gazillion people watch him open toys, guarantee you if he took some sort of fucking the shot, whatever weapon this is meant to be, which is sharper than a motherfucker, if that little kid slices his finger off, mommy and daddy ain't putting him back on the stream. I'm back on the stream. We take the tops of beer cans, okay, and do what with them? Make a... W I don't know what you do. Drink topless? So it's just like a can that you drink a can without a top. Okay. I don't really get the point of that. If we're being honest with each other. Let's see some Cheez-Its. Think they can be reduced fats from sports cards to discreet. They are. So I'll look at it. Sports cards discreet. All right. Sports cards discreet. We going. We're getting back in the flow a little bit. A package within a package. The life of me, I don't understand the point of the package within a package. Like, what is the point of this bag over this? Thing? Unless there was no at. Oop, I almost flipped that. If I lose another finger, then it then this becomes I don't know. It's all I, I don't even know how I do it with with good up. Oh, see, I'm already at a severe disadvantage now, and I'm dealing with a package that already traditionally is my nemesis. Package in a package in a fucking package. I got this guy fucked me. Another package. What is this? How many fucking pack? What is this? All right. At least he made something. I don't know what you do with that. But thank God I didn't go four packages deep for nothing. That would have been a low point. All right. How are we doing on time? 48. I forgot. I don't know how long I was gone when I was in the ER. I don't want to talk to my parents about what happened. I know that's like weird, but I'm Passover no less. To be like, Dad, you're going to kill yourself. Yeah, Mom, I'm fine. I only almost lost half my... What is this? Sublime Visions. Cape Cod Ocean Community. This is a Cape Cod. What is this? This is a shark? It is a shark. What size do we got here? Large. Not like that. I lost so much blood, I thought it was almost over for me. Flow and vent. Al Allendale Fire Department. Thanks for the uh, shirt. It's a cool shirt. Let's keep it going. Speed, speed. As we come to the end of hour, we got to pick up the pace. I feel like maybe I haven't totally gone back into the flow of the offense since I came back. Let's step it up. we got to play the game. The other team, listen, the other team doesn't care if you're hurt. They don't care if you're hurt. What is this? I have no idea what this is. Mr. Portnoy. Tonight you needed a hand with unboxing, and I included some items you may like, sincerely. So this is sent today. What is this? A hand? You just put it in an arm? What is it? A leg? What the fuck is that? No, I don't like that. Ice, stickers, little basketball, the Flintstones. No, this gift stunk. That gift stunk. That didn't help me at all. That didn't help me even a little bit. It sucked. That gift sucked. My mug shot... Police report mugshot when I got arrested. No big deal. I did some time in the clink. I'm one of those guys. You start stacking it up. He did time in the clink. He cut his finger off and didn't miss a beat. He fucking once did four cheese balls in a row on national TV. Somebody is he's just like, oh, think twice when you're going to fuck with that guy. Uh, after this one, we're going to stop it and come back. What? The viewers go down because I'm, I'm not dead? Is that how it goes? That's some bullshit. Nothing. All right. We're coming back. Hour three. 
for you. I'm putting it on the line for you. All right. Hour three. We just keep unboxing the relentless pursuit of perfection in unboxing. What well, what we do here, we unbox for like three and a half hours every night, every fucking night. And then after this is over, while you kids go to bed and have a glass of wine, I send this to Frankie. All the footage, like four hours of fucking footage. That takes for half an hour, 45 minutes. Frankie takes that footage, makes a highlight tape. He don't go to bed. Frankie's not sleeping. We get it out for the people. I go to bed, I get back up. It's a grind. Uncharted apparel. Shark. Ooh, I kind of like that hat. All right, I'm going to give this hat. I like the shark fin. Uncharted apparel. This is shot here. Go uh, shark fin for shark fin. That hat kind of makes me look fucking sick. How do you like them apples? I look fucking awesome in your hats, Uncharted. Uncharted, Uncharted, bear, sweatshirt. I'm going to keep this gray hat because in case you didn't hear, I look awesome. All right. Primal gas, glass, primal glass, Boca Bella, Tom's River, New Jersey, uh, Little League World Series, Todd Frazier. See, I just know a little bit of everything, baby. Jack of all trades, ace of none, except maybe it's just ace of all trades. Ouch. My thumb, a lot of, a lot of guys been forced into positions they don't usually play because I'm losing my finger. Why? What do we got here? Yep. Uh, Boca Bella. Wine from, what is it? No. Vodka. We got vodka. Coconut, mango, pineapple. All right. Oh, from Bartlett's Farm. Bartlett's Farm sending me a fucking gift? Didn't see that one coming. Bartlett's Farm. This is not Bartlett's Farm. Bartlett's Farm is in Nantucket. I live right down the fucking street from it. It's like Brewer's Broskies. Butler's Farm uh, is like the most expensive, but like the best supermarket in the world. They grow all their own shit. And i that's my morning routine in Nantucket. I roll out of bed. And head there, get my coffee. I make up the best macaron cookies. Oh, look at this. Cookies, coaster. Um, I mean, I love Bartlett Farm, so that's just how that goes. Bartlett's Farm, love that with their hat. Reminds me of Nantucket. I wish I was there. Cookies. Oh, Mom, I can't eat a Bartlett's Farm cookie. No, no, I can, all right, because I know who they are. Ooh, ooh. The paper cut on the other side. Oh, these aren't even chocolate chip, though. There's more cookies. I'll just do it later at this point. You gotta just keep unboxing because we had that momentary delay when I said this has already been open, you fucking piece of doof. Just go, Dave. Just go. Just keep running the football right down the throat. What does this say? Dave, finger gear. Put some effing clothes on. Dave, we love what you're effing doing. How many times are you going to say effing, 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 effing? This finger gear, it's like it's half giving the finger, but half like a duck. 
Interesting. Again, hip survive, street culture, maybe. I don't know that I can pull that off. Swag, easy package, swag, swag. Police, New York City Aviation. Is this real? NYPD. I, I don't, this feels like more of a gift shop type vibe. Starting to get the pops that happen when I start running out of room on the lower regions of the floor. Right. We going. Were people nervous for me? Golf balls. When I went down, when I had to escape and go get like band-aids and wrap myself up, was it was it a scene where people like worried or they like, oh, he's a showman? Because I was worried. What are you? Is there anything even in here? No. All this for a hat. Barstool hat? What the hell? Local Massachusetts, four leaf clover. Local, and then Barstool. I don't know that these hats, again, I think these hats are going to be super huge on me. I don't know what brand this is, Boston or something. My guess is it's going to not look good on me. See, it goes like this. See? I mean, does that hat fit? Does it look like it fits right now? It looked like fucking the time, uh, what's his face at? Wisconsin wore our hat. But no, these hats, I just, they're too big, too high brimmed. Especially coming off this hat, which, you know, makes my dick an inch bigger. All right. Kid show. Sorry. It's late. It's been like 3,000 straight nights. Sometimes the things slip out that I wish didn't. What are you? What are you in this package? Tube guy. I feel like tube guy comes with um with sex kits a lot. No, it's just a plug for tube guy. I feel like I just heard a weird noise. I don't, a lot of people are going to go back and be like, that's what you get for doing the brownies. You got your fucking finger cut off. One thing had literally nothing to do with the other. If you go back and watch the tape, I was like wrestling with that thing. I'm like, is this even a weapon? I couldn't figure it out. Mug, best Dave ever. Get it? Best day, best Dave? We should make those. Welcome one. One time come up with an idea. I feel like I'm hearing this. Like an echo. Oh, it's in here. Hawk Family, Monmouth University. I feel like... How do I... Hello? Hello? Oh, right there. You just do it like this. I knew... I guarantee you, I'm not reading the comments. I guarantee you people are like, Dave's losing his mind. I wasn't fucking losing his mind. I heard this. Fucking guy. I wasn't losing my mind. I knew I fucking heard something. Who's, um, oh, who's that? Scott Wayland, uh, Stone Temple Pilots, when he used to, uh, oh, come on now, Dave. Um, give me his, oh my God, my brain. He sings in the megaphone, Stone Temple Pilots. Um, uh, oh my God. No, that's Pearl Jam. Ah, Stone Temple Pilots. I'll get it. Don't worry. I don't want to look in the comments. I love Stone Temple Pilots. That's how dead my brain is. Tick tock. No, not that. Come on. I know. I'll get it. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I'm going to get it. I'm going to get Stone Temple Pilots. Uh, shit. I'm going to get Stone Temple Pilots. I'm going to sing the fuck out of it. I'm just thinking about Stone Temple Pilots right now. What is this? 
<laughs> dancey dance. Dancey dance. Dancey dance. We're going to get a little gummies, a little fucking grass. Yeah, baby. I'm going to do some gummies before I go to bed and go to a whole different planet by myself and forget about all my words. Don't open with sword. Don't worry. I'm kind of down on my sword right now, even though it wasn't the sword's fault. But Come on, Stone Temple Pirates. Professional teeth whitening. All right. I, I can't believe I can't think of one Stone Temple Pilot song when like they had a million awesome ones. We got uh, vaginal sex, ultimate orgasm experience, fuckered, textured holes. So what you do, you fuck and you come in this fake thing. Kids show, no thanks, don't say it. Kids show, kids watching. Daddy, what are they talking about? Oh, don't worry about it. It's just a kid's show. He likes pizza. Cheese. Oh, I'm on time. 10.02. What? So that means I got to end, right? Yeah, probably. Huh? I'm kidding. No. I'm, no, we just started. What's going on? $100 bill? Why am I getting a $100 bill? Is this to give to a delivery person, maybe? What's the point of putting a hundred dollar bill? Dave, you tan, ocean blue eyed goddess porn star. Good start. Our company is the the Amazon for CBD. We thought you'd rather. I don't get it. They didn't. I. I. This will go to the delivery guy. We'll give a hundred dollars to. We give what? Probably like two hundred bucks out to the delivery people every day. So all the people like, oh, your delivery people must hate us. They're actually probably fucking fighting over us to get the right. Candy Grams, a colorful crossword game. Contents, two dice, 11 instructions, two to four players, age seven up. Okay. I thought there's going to be something like, don't make a mess, like sex game for older since we're an older crowd, but no. I don't think so. This is session three. So if we start eight, eight to nine, nine, yeah. So we got plenty of time on this. I had it wrong. Uh oh, what is this? Is an Alabama hat? Who is this? Mark Van Vendet Charitable Fund. Who's Mark Vendet? He played Alabama. Mahi Mike Brand. A lot of different shit in here. I kind of like this football hat. I don't really understand what's going on though in the package. Mahi, Mahi. So, what's the charity? Is that just a trick? Hey, Prez, I just appreciate Italian that loves uh, Barcel Mahi Mike swag and some Mark Vande charitable fund. You're the goat. I like the charitable fund stuff a lot. But that's a pretty fucking cool hat. I have no idea who this fucking cat is, but I like the hat. And I don't understand what the charity is either. It was more about the brand. Hands hurt. <clears throat> AC, Sh AC Schuttles. I thought this was going to say AC Slater, which would have been fucking awesome. When you take a, it, it, everyone knows what Slatering is, right? It's when you sit on a toilet backwards and drop a deuce like you're sitting in a chair. Dave Portnoy uh, from Mike Floric, New York. I'm full blown sweat. Platters chocolate, sponge candy, orange chocolate. What's the other kind? It actually smells good. Are they both dark chocolate, sponge candy? Sorry, Mom. I want to taste this. I, I want to taste it. But what could possibly be wrong with this? I know this person is not poisoning me. It's like a pre-sealed package, airtight. I'm eating it. You're just going to have to trust your son. I got another cut on my thumb. Holy cow. Holy cow. Every time I put the fucking 
Shit in the shit, it hurts. Oh, weird. Like light in the middle. You know what it's like? Um, goober. Is that what they're called? A goober? No, a whopper. That's like a whopper. It tastes like a whopper. Spectrum change your what is this? Buy, eat, change live, repeat, the better bar. Snack in place. Now this is what my mom says she don't want me to eat. And good for her. I don't want you to eat I keep seeing that megaphone, and I keep wanting to uh, eye slides Red Sox. A nice bar stool package here. I believe I can't think of a fucking. Hey, Prez, huge fan of Barstool. And the pizza, Saturday delivery, UPS. All right. Thanks for fighting the good fight. Here's some merch from Killer Jerk. P.S. Fuck Jacks. No offense. Well, it, oh no, that was just the box. Sneakers. Converse? What are these? Oh, that's pretty cool. Eddie Van Halen. Con uh, are these Converse? Or is it they're just Eddie Van Halen's? I don't know. Can I pick? I Can Dave Fortnoy pull these off? You got to be like a pretty big hipster, like a Robbie Fox. Caleb can do it because he's cool. I don't know if I can. I'm going to have to think on that. I'd like to think I can. And I'm going to throw those in the I think I can, but I don't know that I can. I think I can. I don't know. Virginia rocks. I love hot moms. I love hot moms. Um, killer. Just killer. Some interesting stuff from this brand. Well, see how maybe a killer hat looks, right? Virginia rocks. I love 69. I mean... Who doesn't love 69? You gotta be like, oh, not fitting my head right there. Gotta go one back. Hat switch. Hat switch. I'm curious. How's this hat? Yeah, kind of bro -y. Killer. This is an interesting brand. I kind of like it. Like, this is a sweatshirt that I will wear if it's the right size. That's just a killer. I'm going too long on this brand. What size are you? I right, will keep you. Uh, oh, and then, yeah, no, that's fucking cool shit. And by the way, after we throw all this shit, we like redo it. So we go through it the next day and find so much stuff that we missed. Cuts. It's just a haircut place, right? Made the cutters and meat. The only shirt worth wearing. I don't have time to open all of those packages. Got to come out with it. Can't have packages like 10 packages within the packages. Uh, David Day Trader Global stuff. See, I made up time. I knew I took a long time to kill her. So move it right along next to Hartle. It's a cool winter hat. Los Angeles Hartle. Does this fit? Nope. Too big. Mm, back to killer. I do like the. I don't know what this is. Hey Dave, love what you're doing. Keep us entertained while we can't watch. Here's some gear to represent the East Coast. Enjoy the cigar and tequila. So what is Hartle like? A make the Lakers great again. So this is an L.A. company. Clearly Hartle, Los Angeles Hartle. I don't really uh, see the tequila that they're talking about, but that's fine. This is light as a duck. Super light. Oh, sword. What is this? Yeah, 
listen, I can't I can't act scared. If the swords and the weapons know I'm scared, they own me for life. Right now, they respect me. It's like I took half my finger off and I'm still opening new weapons, still pulling them out. No problem. No, no questions asked. This is just a little blade. I love it. I'm still in on weapons, even though I respect them a little. Who, Dave? Be a little bit careful here after what happened. I'd knight somebody with this, and then I take their eye and I cut it out. This is a sheath. This is like, um, you know, I, again, my the little girl in Game of Thrones. What'd she have? Her little sword, um, pretzel. What was the name of that little sword she had? Pretzel. Uh, Arya. Arya. And she just ch -ch 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 -ch. killed the Night King with pretzel. All right. Birkenstock. Did Birkenstock get the wrong address? I'm not a crunchy Vermont person. And let's not pretend that Birkenstock can ever be cool. Nope. Not Birkenstock. It's just a maple syrup. Brothers maple syrup. A lot of maple syrup today. Poor Birkenstock just got dragged for no reason, huh? <laughs> hey, Prez, thought we'd make you a couple shirts since Welker is useless. <laughs> I like this guy. Thought we'd make you a couple shirts since Welker is useless. Love the unboxings. Welker is so useless. Like this is this is a great shirt. DDTG Global. And on the back, it has my 10 tenants. These are the 10 tenants of Barstool uh Dave David Day Chair Global. Let's see what they got. Buy low, sell high. Don't panic. These are mine, by the way. I came up these I came up with these for the firm. Um, number three, don't let a bad trade ruin your next trade. Number four, run the football. Number five, scared money don't make money. Six, the human brain, in, brain invented computers, not vice versa. Seven, John Cheney's amoeba defense. Eight, coffee is for closers. Nine, patience, 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 attack. Ten, fuck Boeing. Amen to that. Welker, again, furiously, this, by the way, should we fucking auction this off as, as is? Bloody... Haskell 2015, uh, Bob Baffert, Dave stabbed to death shirt. This could probably go for like billions on the open market. Stomach looks a little gross. The fucking cage. All right, let's go. Hey, Welker, you fucking dummy. This is how you make t-shirts without me having to hold your hand for the last 15 decades. Right here, buddy. Is it that hard? Is that that hard, Welker? One time. Use that new. Oh, the other one. Give the other one away. I don't know who's taking it worse today, Welker or fucking Jax. And by the way, if you don't know who Mike Welker is, he's our t-shirt guy. He's been our t-shirt guy for about 15 years. He's the bane of my existence. Nice guy. Super nice guy. Just drives me insane. I'd like him. I'd be friends with him if I didn't have to work with him and deal with his incompetence. I do like him, though. What do we got? Uh, what is this? Southern Star Brewing Company. And you got a girl riding a pup rocket. Very American. Too racy for me. Ooh, I don't like giving the freeze, but that's a pretty fucking cool looking can. All right. I shouldn't be touching my face like that. That gives Corona life. I can't wait for Corona to be done. People keep asking me, how am I going to get stop presents? I'm just going to stop accepting them. All right? I'll just throw them away or tell them we won't do unboxing. Who wants to send presents when I'm not opening? Oh, this poor guy. Look, dude, this poor fucking guy sent the gag gift. But then they show what it is. So I already know what it is. I already know it's a big old fucking that guy. It's his big old black dick kid show. So it's like it totally ruined it. Like, boom, there it is. I'm not even going to look because I'm, I don't swing that way. And I already knew what it was. Oh, and it doesn't make it into the gallery. Boo-hoo, the prank got ruined. Mm. Too bad. 
Still nothing on that uh, STP. Hung over, hung blue, hung bloody. Fight the hang with the hung. That means fighting the hang with the hung. The hung the flag. I don't. I thought I'm a big dick at first, but it's like holding hung bloodies. Hung bloodies. Bloody Mary. It's a Bloody Mary drink. It's actually a pretty fucking cool hat. What am I wearing? Eh, I don't know that this one's going to fit me right. Yeah, you know what? Almost got it. You almost got the hat where if people are playing a game of drinking game based on me putting on hats, you've had a couple very tight calls. Emotions running high probably. Be like, is he going to put it on? Because I thought I was. And something just clicks. It's like, you know what? Not worth it. Books? A book of good jokes? Jokes? I don't roast marshmallows because they are hard to make fun of? Dude. I mean, I don't know who that guy is, but it's insulting to think you got to give me a joke book. I'm a, I'm a joke maker. I'm a comedian. That's what I do for a living. My hands take... Like, I haven't mentioned it because I don't want any sympathy, but... Doing this with one less finger, it's almost impossible. What is this? Some baseball team, the Reno Aces Baseball Club. It's kind of a cool, like, hoodie right there, the Reno Aces. What is this, like, some sort of Hawaiian shirt? I, yeah, I, I don't, I, like, I can't even open it. What size is this? Kind of funny shirt. Large. The Reno. Reno Aces. I need some cream. Kind of fitting this box. It has a uh, couple of my famous injuries that I overcame on it. Broken neck. Broken jaw. Right now I'm playing with nine fingers. Something smells good. I almost just choked, like really laying it out. I just hope the kid's at home. It's Michael Jordan flu game. It's fucking uh, the guy in the Knicks coming out on one leg. Tetan survival. Ooh, little survival kit. It's kind of cool. That's kind of cute, actually. I could have used that earlier. I forgot I have all these things. Willis Reed on one leg. And now the Dave Portnoy finger game. Things that go down. Sports lure. Lore. Lure. Lore. Take time. To spend it. It's something. That is it. Take time. Take time. It's something like that. Take time. Damn. Can't get it. I'm not going to look at the comments. I'm not going to cheat. Take time. I'm getting every time I'm thinking uh, STP, I'm getting like, oh, geez. There's a ton of eyeglasses that all look stupid. Cheap ass eyeglasses. That seems like that was a trick to put something on me. How are we doing? 1019. We doing? Oh, I hate these packages. Commonwealth Strategies to Dave L. Prez Fortnite. This guy just. How about one for the other thumb, Super Bowl? I mean, I don't want to say that this is a little bit late for that sweatshirt, dude, but that ship has passed. You just sent me a bunch of Brady old, like, don't send those to me. Send those to fucking Africa. America supports you. Thank you. Our military men and women. Everyone knows I'm very pro-military, respect the fuck and everything you do. I don't even think you can, like, fathom what it's like to be overseas fighting or anywhere, really, uh, unless you do it, which I've never done. Men in blue. Asbury Park's APD Braves at Asbury Park. Asbury Park uh, is uh, Paul Simon, correct? We'll put those over there. 
What is this little guy? What are you little guy? What is this little fucking guy? What could be so cute in here that needs to be iced up? A piece of cake? Something that's gonna jump out at me? What is this? New York. Shutterfly. Huh. What is this gonna be? I have no door. Okay, he's gonna leave it downstairs. Thanks. Yeah, I'll buzz in. You can just leave it downstairs. Dude, it's such a waste of food. Send it to hospitals. Do something. I don't even get these deliveries. I don't even go downstairs to get them. But that was Uber Eats. How do you open this fucking thing? Cut carefully. I am cutting carefully. What's going on here? Oh my god. Wait, what is this? Stella? I mean, I, I. King of Pizza and Stella Bean Portnoy. King of the Toys. With that, I mean, that's my girl. I get sad every time I get it. It's sweet, but it is sad. I miss her. So that sucks. Trying not to, like, bring the mood down, but I miss my dog. F you cancer. Fucking right, F you cancer. Listen, if you can't get on that team, if you can't get on the F you cancer team, I don't want you on any team. Like, we can all agree, like, fuck cancer. You know? Everyone's like, oh, we got all our forces right now are on Corona. Everyone's like, fuck Corona. We're in a fucking battle. Like, Corona, Corona. Cancer's over the hill. Don't forget that. Cancer ain't going anywhere. We got to fuck them, too. What is all this? David Portnoy. That's my name. City image where the John Bleakers of barbershops. All right. I wonder if they're open. Support your local barber. It's a big safety stay near the. I don't know what this, what that sticker means. High claim team. No way. All right. And they have the packaging I don't like. Nothing. Or it poured out. I'm pretty sure that's turning into the gag gift. It's a pile of junk. Wreck T Grills. What? Wreck T Grills. Flavor, convenience, Wreck Tree Grills. It's a Wreck, wreck T Grills. Ah, gross. Gross. Now, I'm curious. Is this a prank gift, or is this just somebody who's not calling along? Because we have a ton of wonderful pistachios. Astro Flow. Dear Al Press, Davey Page Views. See the hand issue here? Uh, King of the Beach, a.k.a. three-team uh, beat King Survivor, U.S. Open champion, dip-off champ, take one scoop of this moonshot to get fired up and laser focused for the first and last. So, so, so this is not a joke. It is somebody who sent some sort of produce, and that just shows how stupid these people are. They have no marketing sense that you put wonderful pistachios that literally make me vomit when I see them because it's just so disrespectful to the entire pistachio game that somehow wonderful pistachios has become the pistachio that's represented in all stores, and it stinks, and it's embarrassing for good pistachios. Oh, it's these guys again, who I have no fucking clue who they are. This is heavy, so this is probably some drink thing that I want no part of. Ugly box. Oh, I could be very wrong, people. Chef, it's Wood Chateau 
Gabby. Chateau Gabby. I apologize because this looks like the real deal. Holy field. Whoa. How much is this? Look at this fucking thing. Chateau Gabby. A huge thing of Grand Vin de Bordeaux. Miss and Body Ashani Con Fransoc France. A Chateau Gabby 2012. This this looks. What's this one? The Bordeaux. Two, oh, 2000 and big old bottles. Magnums. I'm going to look this. And what is this? Lux wine opener. I have a good feeling on these two. Real good feeling. Now, I could have been more wrong being like, oh, there's going to be some cheap ass shit. Or maybe it is, but it looks wrong. Uh, what do we got? 30. Reese's eggs, automatic disqualification, automatic disqualification. Don't even move past it. You put some of those pistachios in, I stop looking. I want, it's disrespectful. Pick me, they say. I got a feeling this is my buddy again. No, I don't know what it is. Paint by Sharon. Okay. Paint by Sharon on Instagram. Picture of me looking fucking great, and I don't think it's just because of the guy. I'm <laughs> look at this guy. Uh, all in a pizza. She nailed my eyes. My eyes are an electric factory. Paint by Sharon. IG, what? They get a lot of stuff. Gino's, Gino's Puss Boy, whenever you have read Gino's. I guess there's a guy who kept telling me to go to Gino's. Lift with your legs. I keep forgetting to do that to put on the back scratch thing. All right. Not back scratch. Yeah, the back. Uh, the thing for my back so it doesn't hurt when I'm going up and down. Prep baseball report. Lake Point. Kind of cool. Hat. Ooh, this hat's a wild scene at the park, huh? Go with that hat. The bucket hat. There's like some preppy shit going on here. I don't hate it. Do not hate it at all. Adidas just baseball prep report. I don't really know what that is, but a little fucking. We still want to fuck cancer. Just because I threw that hat away doesn't mean cancer's off the hook. Cancer's still very much on the hook. All right. The biggest blanket in the world. Big blanket six. Caution. Oversized load. That's what she said. How do you get this fucker? This thing's going to be a fuck. This thing's going to be a fuck. I don't know how much time we're going to give this thing if I can't figure this fuck out. I assume it's just a big blanket. Yeah, this thing's... Oh. This thing's being a... Eh. Maybe we'll get it. All right. This thing's being a fuck. I knew it was going to be. You can tell. Hey, they thought a man that loves pizza so much deserves a will the biggest blanket. So it's not going to be like a custom blanket. It's just a... All right, it's just, I did all that for a big blanket. It's a big blanket. That's what the thing is. It's just a fucking big blanket. On the opposite side of the spectrum, this thing's light as a pussycat. Oh, we got a, uh, a straw hat for the boy. Margaritaville. Jimmy Buffett. Everyone knows. 
my guy, when I uh, started Barstool, the first time I was going to be invested, they asked me, who are the, it's just my radio bill, uh, who are the two businesses that I appreciated the most or like followed Jim Buffett? And Rob Dyrdek, a little known fact, those are the two guys that I thought took like one specific vertical and turned it into a lifestyle brand, kind of like um, yours truly. Rare items, fragile, handle with coin. Well, I mean, care. Doesn't look, ooh, picked that up the wrong way. Doesn't look like that's going to be that rare, if we're being serious. Take time to, something like that. Box in a box. I don't believe that this is rare, and I don't believe that this is fragile, and I don't know what I'm getting, but it could be a gag gift. Oh, for the smoky stuff. This is for the smoky stuff. This is Burning Man certified. Got me. Got me with the fake fucking spider. Congrats, buddy. <laughs> Son of a bitch. You don't get me if my finger's not sliced off. I'm working with fucking four fingers. I'm trying to think of this fucking Stone Temple Pilot song. And I got spidered. IP in pools. I don't. In fact, when I was a camp counselor, I refused to go in the pools and got fired because I know all those little rap kids are fucking pissing in it. I wouldn't let a kid under the age of 15 in a pool, period. That's a national law. You know what they're doing. They're fucking pissing in it. Thank you for all the entertainment. And all you do for law enforcement across the country, enjoy these. Our Boston Sports Patches City of Champions Challenge coin from your faithful ATF stoolies from across the nation. P.S. Even though you're sensei with your samurai sword, true hatchet and other artillery, it's a wonder you haven't severed an artery. Open up all these boxes. Well, funny you mention that. I included a heavier duty or med kit for when band aids just won't do it. This guy had a little glimpse into the future. Ooh, those are fucking cool. Those are good giveaways. Keep those. Yeah, no. Keep this. Uh, we will keep this near because we did have what we just, we, the big one, you know, at Talladega waiting for the big crash. We had the big one. Check out that arm. That's a professional arm. You can't have a better looking arm than that. It's tanned. It's dexterity. It's cut up. It fucking looks great. Yeah, I've been doing prison rules in quarantine. Yeah, I'm eating, but I'm fucking hitting like. 20 push-ups, some dips, pull-ups, and the biceps are showing it. That's why prisoners get big. It's like, what else are you going to do? Uh, relief band. That's me looking at a pizza. And that's a spot the dog. John Leonard. Kind of like a John Leonard's picture is like on the box. What is this? It's like grass. Feed, not like grass weed, like oh no, it's just it's covering. Yeti I can't even read what it says. Leonard bus sales. This guy this guy sells buses. Cheez Its. Hey, long time school uh blah blah. Let's we sell school buses all over New York State. Let's beat Corona. Selling school buses. And who do you sell a school bus to? You can't even read what it says. I'm going to stick with the buffet. I like that hat, though, but you can't even read it. Stanky powder. What does that mean? Unscented premium powder. Stanky powder. I don't have to open it. That's just what it is. Ring Boost? Pleasantville? What is Ring Boost? How are we doing? Time. We're doing all right. We may end up in that fourth hour again. Ring, I really ring boost maybe in too. Yeah, no, this stinks. Um, next, should have seen that ring boost just being a marketing play a mile away. Cut 
custom floors and installation. And what is this? Just a brick? I mean, is this what? What did they send me? Brick? Yeah, it was still brick by brick. You guys already sent that. It's Cabriolet again. Why would you send multiple packages? My hands just took 10 beatings in there. The Sushi Legend. Ooh, who's the Sushi Legend? I like that. I want to be a Sushi Legend. I have no problem with being a fucking Sushi Legend. But these new era hats don't ever fit me right. That's too bad. That's a good hat, but it won't fit me right. Big fans, NASA. I don't know what that is. Quarter zip. Come on. What are these? Oh my God. I think I got another samurai sword. Uh, it's one part of a weapon. Which is now in the wrong way, and I almost fucking slice myself. Talk about a poorly packaged major weapon. Another samurai sword. What? This thing was packaged upside down. And if I wasn't one with the weapons, I could have had another finger injury, which would have really put me behind the eight ball because I'm already down a finger tonight. Priority Mail Express, elephant. All right. All right. This is well packaged. I don't know how people know how they even do shit like that. Oh, package in a package. Package in a package. Elephant. Live for the weekend. Okay, I'm fine with that. And police? Police jacket. I mean, if a fleece jacket is the best, most interesting thing that you can send me when I'm opening 5,000 packages, you probably can send them. Like just a solid fleece jacket? Really? Come on. Uh, barbell. Nope, too much packaging. We're just getting a lot of junk right now. There's nothing I can do about it. They're just marketing buckets, like packed with a million things. I think this one's going to be it, too. I mean, like, I listen, if you do this, I'm not going to even look. Like, if you send a million packages, I have no idea what that is. You cannot send, first of all, stop sending. But if you have something so good, but I'm not going to open 9,000 packages. It just comes across as an extreme marketing. And speaking of the devil, Prairie Grill, wake your coffee. Bad streak right here. Oh, all right. Now, this is something I can deal with. See, they made fucking towels of DDTG Global. What does that say? Does that say D? Uh, what does it say? What does it say? Positive vibes only. All right. I can deal with that. Positive vibes only. And then the, the logo. And a super fleecy, super fucking comfortable towel and then they got a pizza one too and they don't even put who they are they're just trying to get in the game 
That's how. Oh, I thought I had this disaster. That's how you do it. That's how you do it. We're getting there, by the way. We are a volunteer-run charity event in Springfield, Illinois, giving over a million to charity. The race includes my food, booze, running. We'd love to shout out. Easy. Shout out. Eat ass 5K security. There's his shout out. All right, 24,000 people. We're going to shut it. Come back. We'll be back in five minutes. I can fix my finger, and then we'll figure the last one out. All right, 25 minutes. Tell your friends. If we go under 20 on Instagram, I'm fucking out.
All right. Sorry for the, uh, well, we got one person. We'll let go. Had to redo the bandages. So sorry that took so long to get back. And I don't know whether you'll be able to see it, but if the amount of, it was, it's still like the amount of blood that is in that Band-Aid right there. And that was like well after the fact. I mean, it's still like a scene. I mean, that is for the YouTube people. That going that way. I mean, it, it, I don't know if you, that's just, I lost gallons of blood. Gallons of blood. So I'm just watching out to make sure Corona is sneak in there because I can feel the band aid getting loose. And when I put the new band aid on, it was still bleeding. And there goes the hand sanitizer, which has become a crucial part. I like a purple mumba right now. Um, a state services. So we probably got 25 minutes left of this show. We're at 15,000. I lost a lot. Maybe I just wait and end it quick or into a special tomorrow. I mean, we're going to not do Easter. What is this? It was a longer delay than usual because I, sorry, my finger got cut off. Giddy. GetMeGiddy.com. Sex toy? Congratulations. You've taken a huge step in treating your erectile dysfunction. You. You. What do you do with this? Not that I'm interested. We're excited. Uh, excess. Giddy's mission to help men and women improve their sexual health through the use of our information for products. I don't know what the fuck that means. That didn't seem like very helpful. Four oh six concepts established two thousand twelve. Trick box. Do you think more people in the world, if you're like, hey, we can develop a cure for fucking erectile dysfunction or corona? What do you think people would pick? These concepts. Is gonna be entering film. Oh, fuck, right. What a perfect sign to get me. What a perfect fucking sign to get me. I'm going to put that right up. That's Art City, baby. Put that over there. Everybody has their one spot where it's just like, that's your fucking home and where you feel at peace and just happy. Mine is most definitely in Nantucket. Nice note. Oh, big note. Thank you for supporting little guy. Here are two very important things I sent in this box. I, I made one par scratch baked pizza. I made 100% from scratch. Took about three days to make. How's that possible? How does it take three days to make a fucking pizza? What else were you doing? Um, like an awesome. Second thing is a product design concept working at home. The concept fits perfectly. Barcel, I'd love if you could help me bring. All right, dude, too much talking here. So you got a homemade pizza. Let's, I guess, see what this fucking looks like. I have an itch, but I don't feel like I'm quarantined right now. This guy really packages the shit out of this. You're killing me. All right, here's his homemade pizza. It actually looks pretty fucking good. So we're going to have to keep this note with it so we know what we're doing. And then what is his concept that he wants us to Please open off camera. I can't open off camera, dude. I mean, if this is his life, fine, I will. You know, I, I'm not going to open it at all. But he, he, I, no, there's no opening off camera. It's either not on camera, or not at all. That's his prototype. That's his life work or whatever. I'm not going to ruin it. I'm just not going to open it. This is an on camera show. Dave Portnoy is live all the time. I don't do, I don't, it's what I said to Michelle Beadle. When I got in a fight with Michelle Beadle, ow, these fucking paper cuts. Oh, damn. What is that fucking Stone Temple Pilot? Take time to understand. What is it? I told Michelle Beadle. 
She's DMing me all this stuff. Hey, Michelle, why are you DMing? Put it out in public. I'm a public guy. If you have something to say to me on DMs, say it in public. I don't DM. If I DM you, other than a girl, it's public. Oh, man. The, uh, the anti-bacterial is tearing me apart. What is this? Barstool Sports. What are you? What is that? A girl's hair? I have no idea what that is. This is a cool packaging. Duval. Oh, yeah. These guys do Vin. They send a lot of shit. I generally do like their stuff. This is going to be like shorts and whatnot, probably. The. It, all-time uh, free offender. Dan, I feel like Dan and Hank are on contract with these guys. Some flamingo shorts, hoop shorts, good shit. Uh, I, I am a fan of their brand. Lakeside maple is kind of heavy. This is going to be... This, is this going to just be maple syrup? This is not the maple syrup... Oh, good. We got back over 20. boy. Way to go, people. Way to go. This is Davey Daytrade's next move. Let's take it. Wake up water. Nope. You're just way out of the loop if you think I'm going to pitch a water right now. Is this going to be maple syrup, maybe? It's a maple company. But all the people sending water or drinks that we're not going to promote, rest assured, we're giving them to, like, hospitals and charities and trail mix. Spicy. It actually looks like if you like trail mix, it does look pretty fucking good. I'll give it a shot and give the rest away. Pop, pop, pop. Tree olive. Why do I feel like this is going to be CBD? I've been wrong a lot, though, today. Tree olive, what do you guys do? Thanks for entertainment. No good pizza ever been made without olive oil. Okay, a lot of olive oil, people. Olive oil is creeping up the list. Cool packaging of something that they're just... I'm getting a shit from. Baker's... Door. Yeah, you can just drop it inside. I think this is the most deliveries we've had in the middle. What fucking time is it? 10, it's 10.55 and we're getting deliveries? Who, who even, what, fast food? I mean, who even fucking delivers right now in the middle of the Corona bill? Baker's Sporting Goods. So a sporting goods store? Yeah. Oh. What is this? Custom Portnoy shirt. Bar stool. All right, fuck it. I'll wear this. Throw this fucking hat on. Get this fucking hat off. Get this fucking shirt off. Put this shirt on. A little USA action here. It's kind of cool. A little custom. Let hopefully some fucking chest hair pops out of there. A little fucking Rob Deere action. Ladies. That's how you do it. What are these other shirts? Fifteen Duval. Uh, what's his face? Jacksonville. <laughs> All right. Still going. Ottoman Bianda Lilla, Huntington, New York. Huntington's Little Vincent's, the uh, the cold, the, what is all of, oh, goldfish, pizza goldfish, and getting iced, which we don't get iced, people try to ice me, that's been very well documented, I'm not, homie don't play that, whatever, can't even read it, everybody alright around here, everyone, oh, shit, everyone calm with slip sliding, 
Torg, leave your tread. What does that mean? It's got like a skeleton with a hat on back. Quite scary, if we're being honest, for a logo, I think. We'll see what we got. A little paper cut there. A little rip there. See? Told you it was scary. Green sweatshirt. I think this works for a girl more than a guy. Like, a girl can get away with a little bit of the Skulls Motorcycle Company. But I don't know that, like, I can necessarily. If I wear that Skulls, that, that means the guy, if he touches, like, the girl I'm with ass, I have to fight him. I don't do that. I would more, like, talk behind their back. Wildlife Habitat's giant ant farm. Uh, no thanks. I don't think there's going to be actual ants in here. But if there was, yeah. Warning, ant. What? See live ants. No, I don't. Yo. I'm fucking out on ants. Yeah, I like the ones in the movies that are like the cute, like the what's the name of that movie? Ant. My hair looked fucking sneaky, like kind of sexy, like bedheadish right now. That's for the ladies, I guess. I think it kind of does, even though it's a disaster. All right, Doctor Pickle. Doctor Pickle is gonna have to come into something massive because Grillo's pickle, those Ewing. I think it was the unboxing one. The Ewing sneakers are like still one of my top gifts. The 92 Ewing pickles. But they didn't. Dr. Pickle. But they. Are they all right. Is Dr. Pickle going to send me half sours? Dr. Pickle. I, no one sent me half sours. Nope. They're just not paying attention. Because I couldn't have made it clearer. I want half sour pickles. And they sent me. Full sour. Hey, I want everyone to boycott Dr. Pickle. If you ever see Dr. Pickle, be like, no thanks. They're run by people who don't know what they're doing. I've said I like half sour multiple times. What do they do? Full sour. Fuck you, Dr. Pickle. Have somebody who knows what they're doing. You can't just send. How come marketing people today stink? Like, what is the point of sending something if you're not paying attention, don't know who you're sending it to? Horseshoes? Four leaf clover, may the shamrock wine rack bring you luck at the track and on day training. That's kind of cool, right? I'm not Irish, so I can't do that, even though I like it. But this is a good giveaway item. Like I, a star of David or something, like that, maybe. Oh, I just saw that box of Kit Kats calling my name. Hey, people, don't forget to be fucking. Damn, you're kind. Don't forget about that. Is this the first re-hat ever? And a winter hat at that. Kind of a ballsy move at this hour. How do you open you? Dude, I don't even know where to start to open you. There it is. All right. A lot of shirts today. Uh, the, the Chiefy clothing. I don't know what that is. To Chiefy, it's like uh, a thing. It looks like a moose with maybe a lacrosse stick. I don't know what this guy is, but it's a nice card. Oh, they did the thing I love, the seal. Mr. Dave Portnoy and guest, is this another wedding invite? Covington, Louisiana. No wonder it's so nice. I think I'm getting invited to a wedding, people. And by the way, it looks like a rich wedding. Mr. and Mrs. Keith Laudner request the pleasure of your company, the marriage of their daughter, Caitlin Christian and John... Hemp Hill. All right. Well, well, now I'm confused. And I don't mean to show the whole card, but I'm showing the whole card. They sent it. It is just a cross out. It says Saturday the 28th of March, and there's a strike through, and they wrote in 7th. It says 2021. Oh, is it because it says fuck Corona. So they have to change everything? Because these are super nice cards. Maybe these are defective now. The 7th of March. It's the 28th of March, 27th. Fuck Corona, 21. So they did. They had to back up their wedding a year. And they changed the date. Huh. That, that sucks. At least they reacted quickly. Is that my birthday? 20. 
No, 27th. That's March Madness, though. So I don't think I can make it. That sucks, though. You, you forget about these married people, right? Although maybe it doesn't suck for that guy. He got another fucking year out of the deal. He's probably like, oh, it sucks. But deep down, he's like, boys, fucking another year. Um, I don't know what this is. Nails and packages and wood. And I actually need this. This is actually a great gift. Um, Prez figured you could use some plies to hang around the beautiful fi picture frames. I actually do. This is, while somewhat boring, very, very useful. And I don't want Spider to throw it away. So I'm fucking it. Yeah, that's a good gift. Yeah. All right. We're getting into the nitty gritty, folks. The nitty gritty. Into the 11 o'clock hour, the world's longest unboxing show. Just never ends. So many presents, fingers lost, paper cuts just all over the map. Artifact. Artifact sneakers. I don't know if they got my size right. I wear white sneakers. I don't know what the deal is with these. I wear Common Project, so I, these look like Common Project knockouts. How much does an artifact sneaker cost? I would guess those, the Common Projects are 400 I'm guessing those are like 100 But I have no idea. This could be Weapon City. We may be in Weapon City right here. I think we're in Weapon City. Yeah, we are. It's crazy because I'm so good with weapons that I got victimized by a weapon earlier today. I have two sets of these now. And I don't know what... It, what there's maybe more weapons in here. Oh, these are the gross nunchucks. I think I could have a lot of weapons. Now that I'm looking, there's a bunch of these things. The cadre continues. I mean, these long things now I'm thinking are all going to be vicious weapons of destruction. Gun knife? Steampunk gun knife. A true piece of art. The other word, steampunk gun knife, is a must-have to add to your collection or costume. Elegantly good designed gun handle features a spinning barrel. Gives it realistic look. So this is just to, to trick people. Be like, oh, shit. Wait a minute. Is it a gun? Why is it like kept in a... Oh, because it's a knife. What is this? It's a gun knife? Oh, well, I mean... This does not look like a gun. This looks like a knife that's very dangerous and can kill you. I mean, look at it. That's no, like, it's got the razor thing at the end. So I don't know what they're talking about when they're like, oh, it's super realistic looking as a gun. This, this thing is super realistic looking as, like, a vicious weapon of death, but just not a gun. Yeah, I guess this part, like, hey, I'm shooting, but I'm actually gutting you know, like a dead fish. Welcome to, the, welcome to the team, gun knife. Whoa. Gun knife almost just got loosey-goosey on me and came out the other side. I think we could have another weapon here. This is just turning into like uh, arsenal training. I'm going to be on like the FBI's watch list. Am I on camera here? Yeah. It's half a weapon, right? I have no idea what I got right now. 
a plunge. Is this from fucking Vinny? It's a plunger. This has got to be from Vinny. Dave, big fan. Notice you've been eating a bunch of random shit. All right, fine. Just a plunger. Just a straight fucking plunger. Listen, everyone poops. It's natural. This is empty. Another long one. All the long ones packed in the same corner here. We've had plungers, we've had knives, we've had everything. Still going, keep the momentum up. Fourth quarter. This is where you win it. This is where you win and lose. This looks like some sort of weapon. Yep. Whoa, what is this? There's my name on it. Oh, wait a minute. So it says, in a very strangely kid-like fashion, El Presidente with a dragon. Oh, what a beautiful samurai sword. I mean, this thing, it's got the Chinese on it. This thing's beautiful. Did it have a case? I like how it says my name. I don't like how I put it in the wrong way. Can I walk the streets to like work when we're uncoroned, just carrying samurai swords, like a like a backpack, a custom backpack with like six samurai swords in it, and maybe just Chinese stars on my hip? This fucking thing looks like it's made out of cherry wood. I love it. Thank you. I have so many weapons. Unbelievable amount of weapons, and I don't want to give them away. I want to like hang them in my weapon room. You ever use them? Yeah, I use them. Old school picture coming in here. This is, I don't even know where we're going with this. All right, so we got this long tweet here, and let's read it. Prez, this has been weighing on me for 10 years. I bought you a shot at Stula Palooza, and you, and you didn't wait to take it. Hopefully, accept this blue shirt to bring out the blue eyes as a token of my apologies. Uh, oh, we didn't wait for you to take it. Sorry for using a pick of old day, but your no Nomar jersey is sick. Guy in the back. P.S. This guy. Is this guy. Um, read your email. My roommate's sister did not appreciate me saying she looked like she could use a dick in her mouth. Uh, <laughs> Uh, there's a lot. There's just a lot going on here. I'll try to. I mean, I may read. That may be my bedtime reading tonight. And he sends me a blue shirt from back at Stool Palooza, Fat Dave, in a picture. All right. Pizza? What do we got here? Good Squad. North County Supplies. What is this? Oh, yeah, pizza. Uh, I don't know from who. It's a fucking huge... What is this? Did you know? I don't even know what this fucking thing is. Potato chips? Why would you put a cooler with potato chips? That makes no sense. None. Heavy shipping department, Georgia. For a second, I thought we had uh, nutrition, which is going to be thrown away very quick. Thank you for keeping us entertained. Hope this small gift. Fuck jacks. All right, I'm in with fuck jacks. What is this? Cornhole. It's a all sorts of the force is one coronavirus so they make cornhole stuff all right that's not a bad deal west georgia cornhole fuck jacks is right that's what you get i bet they didn't think they'd be having the cornhole thing made all right this guy's light as a feather a lot of fuck jacks tonight
What is this? Women for women. Every box of core purchase helped present. What is this? And thumb tax? I don't know what's that. This is organic tampons. Sweet. Fragile. Fragile like Davy Day Trader. Tainted Saint LLC. This doesn't bold well. Fragile like Trader. The word taint in the delivery. Be on the lookout for something. Fragile all over it. I don't know. No, oh, there's glasses. It's kind of weird. I thought it was going to be more than that after that delivery. We sell customized candles. Okay. Getting down to it. Getting down to it. About seven or eight to go. What time is eleven thirteen? Still over twenty five on the Insta, which is not bad considering I took that long away. We've been doing it, and I don't know how many people are on YouTube. You can't see the packages sometimes on YouTube. Lost a finger today, and we're still going. We're just behind it. It's like a four hour, three and a half hour show every night. Cutest baby face. What does that mean? It's a present. Is it, it's a present within present. I don't know what this is. This is like a real present wrapping. So now we go to this. I can rip this with my hands, I would think, even though my shoulders are broken. I have no energy. I'm just playing on guts, determination. Honest, gentle, absorb it. What are these, fucking diapers? We're getting diapers? Was that even to me? Are we just taking like packages that don't even belong to us now? West Palm Beach, Florida checking in. Why would he send me diapers? Oh, an Easter basket? I'm surprised I didn't get more Easter baskets. I mean, tomorrow's Easter. Yeah, nice. Little Easter basket of toilet paper. A CD of Mrs. Doubtfire. Smirnoff Ice. Again. I'm going to have like a 50 pack of Smirnoff Ice. Weapon. This thing in the white has to be a weapon. Put that between my legs and open this, which, yeah, I can already feel that this is a weapon. Whoa. A million packages. Like, that's how you know it's a weapon, because it's sharp, so they put in a million fucking things. I'm trying. Everybody just chill out. I'm trying to fucking open it. It's not that easy. See what happens when you rush it? You get fucking knives coming at you. This game's for not for the faint of heart. I wonder if it's gonna be a new weapon or an old weapon. this looks like a new weapon this looks like a machete yeah. yeah new weapon new weapon two 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 just this is if you want to cut a head off for this one this is just head on ground this is I'm gonna call these guys the beheaders. Vicious. 
Uh, where do people buy these? You just go online and it's like uh, murderous web knives and whatnot. Murderousknives.com. Who knew? You can just mail murderous knives like it's nobody's business. All right. Let's wrap these guys up so they don't kill anybody by accident. All right. Put those there. Murderous knife collection. Fragile. I think we got some art. Seriously. It's a whole market. Murderousknives.com. Fragile. Open up art late in the game is a pain in the ass because it's the hardest thing to open. And I need every ounce of concentration to make it happen. But I got to talk to people because if I'm not talking, it's just a silent stream of nothingness. Actually, really impressed with myself right there. And now we go to the next round. All right. It's like you got to find the pressure points, and then you got to eliminate, eliminate them. That's unbelievable. The person who did it was Clay at Clay Misner Art. This is like as good a picture of Stella as I've seen. You go from Stella and get me emotional to weapons. No more cell stuff. I really do appreciate it, but it's like sad. Ooh, Cohiba cigars? Is that legal now? Aunt Amanda DeFranco, New York State licensed Asiatist. P.S. If you're ever in Long Island, pamper yourself with the facial by me. Here's my card. De Dear Prez, first off, fuck Jax. Yep. Second, took these stogies from my ex when I moved out because fuck him and got some spicy popcorn because it's delicious. I like this girl. So she stole Cohiba cigars from her fucking loser ex-boyfriend. And now I'm going to fucking smoke them in your face, dude. You ass. You let a good woman go. And spicy popcorn, not my thing, but Cohiba cigars. Cuba, that's like the real deal. Boyfriend just gets it stolen and given to me. That hurts. This thing's light. That's good. I'm glad this guy's light because I don't know. I don't want to. I'm not going to. I'm going to finish just as strong because I always do and I'm a man child. And I don't care if it's fourth quarter, first quarter. I'm laying it out. But I'm glad this guy's a light guy because I didn't want to have to fucking muscle it up. There's a huge box. Four. Up. Oh. A Confederate sword. Now I don't <laughs> I don't get done with the Confederacy. But you gotta have a sword. And when you're looking for every sword in the book, I don't really know what makes it a Confederate. Jesus. Well, that's how that's what makes it a Confederate sword. It looks like a Confederate sword. I don't know if that's like the vibe we're going for. Don't want to be like, oh, that Dave, he was a big Confederate guy. Wants to like lock up the blood. Nope. I'm a Northern Union guy. I do like the song Dixie. Kill me. What are you gonna do? That other that guy who likes you know what's gonna happen. Now my hair is a disaster. The fucking guy who's like, oh, pistachios. He's trying to give all his pistachios. That guy's furiously cutting that up of me holding a Confederate uh, flag with the bar stool. So I'm holding, <laughs> I'm going to be holding a Confederate sword with the bar stool like 
overtly American, and this guy's going to be like, this is the Barstool America. They want to like go back to slavery and cotton picking. Martin, that's what that guy will do. And then we'll have to fucking meme him to death again. What is this? It's just a square of duct tape? I don't think I'm opening this. Is this just designed to fuck with me? I'm not opening that. I'm not open. I will not open just a square. Won't we'll do it. I don't know what's in there, but anybody, you're to, to send that duct tape square and think I'm going to sit here and fucking all my weapons and I'll do this. Nope, that's not sharp. I'll do this to it though. I don't know where any of my fucking weapons are. I got so many of them. There's just like weapons missing. Okay. Yeah. I got one here. This. Oh my god, that didn't even go through. Yeah, this that that's a dick gift. I don't know what that is. But that that like was basically stabbing cement. Oh, I thought I almost stabbed myself. I'm just trying to get a little control of the situation. The iron pigs, Lehigh Valley. Army pigs is Lee. Now I looked at, to go to school at Lehigh. I don't know how anybody goes there. The whole fucking place is on a hill. All I could think about is I gotta go to class. I gotta walk up this fucking hill. I never go. I gotta go out to a club. I gotta climb up this hill. I never fucking go. The whole school is on a hill. This is a big package. Iron Pigs, enjoy some of the world-famous ballpark pizza. Enjoy some of our great merch. Okay, they get the cooler. Iron Pig hat. John. It isn't like Pizza John? What is Pizza John? Is that a Philly thing? Isn't John like, uh, I feel like, I feel like that's, I thought I had more blood. Like, what is John? What is John? That's a Philly thing, right? And then another box on the box. What is in here? Nothing. Iron Pigs hat's kind of cool. Shirt. And then the pizza. I don't even think the pizza's going to be ready. This hat doesn't look good on me at all. See, even like there. It's too big. Look how far. It's going to be New Era. Yep. New Era hats, they just, they're fucking huge. They're too tall. This is fucking heavy. Not fragile. Not fragile. All right. That means we can fuck around with it. Not fragile. Not fragile. The K board. Dewey Beach. Dewey Beach, Delaware. Not fragile. You don't see that much. Not fragile. Where's the box cutter? Where's the box cutter? Box cutter. There we go. Not fragile. I don't see that very often. Ooh, I lost my grip there. Not fragile, not easy to open, though. It's a K-board. The, the, the K-board? Ah, this thing's a bitch to open. I, I, like, who fucking packages this stuff that you can't open? You can't fucking open this. It's going to be like a 10-hour open. There's some sort of board. Is this just like a cutting board? Yeah, all right. We got it. Big paper cut just came through. Big paper cut. I knew it. Blood again. I have 8 million of those little guys on my fucking hand. Because this thing won't open because you package it like a fucking son of a bitch. I mean, come on, man. Why are you, I keep fucking putting all my muscle up. won't fucking open. How else am I supposed to open you without getting a vicious fucking paper cut? You piece of shit. Now I got to do this. Wrong fucking cream. I need the antiviral, and I'm going to yelp. 
I'm going to yelp like a fucking dog when that hits that. Yup. Like six different ones. This game is getting a little too dangerous. Fuck. Who packs like this? What is this anyways? It's just a fucking board? This is just a fucking stupid cutting board. You pieces of shit. Who just sends a fucking cutting board that you can't open that the only thing you can do is get a million paper cuts? I'm fucking... I've lost gallons of blood. I shouldn't even be standing right now. It's just a fucking cutting board? What is this? What are you? What are you? You better be good. Fuck, man. Gushing blood out there now. And not even, I mean, obviously this is nothing compared to what happened earlier. I feel like fucking niche right now when they uh, just fucking throwing dirt on all my injuries. I'm never going to recover. I'm going to be like, I might, I'm might. i not going to have hands. I ha- I'm going to have no hands. I'm going to be hands. What happened today? He opened 9,000 presents during quarantine and broke his hands with uh, infinity paper cuts, slices, weapons. What is this? Prez. I'm getting angry. Keep it together. We're a little late, but congrats on the 66 at Shinnecock. Ship sticks team all stoolies. The shirt is super soft, made for giants. Made for giants. That board company. uh, Like, why are you sending me a cut? There's a million packages in the packages. I'm not opening all the packages. It's got a little Barstool logo on it. I'm going to put some more hand sanitizer on. I'm going to yelp a little bit. I'm gonna... It stings so bad. I'm so fucking tough. Just be tough. Oh, that fucking hurts. Got to do it, though. Got to keep antibacterial and got to. Pizza tools included? What does that mean? I'm really mad at that board. Time to give your oven a break. Pizza maker. It's an oven. I already got like four of those. What is this song? Take time to conquer time. Something like that. And there's like 10 of them. I don't want to look at them. Whoa. I'm silently in my rage getting through the gifts. I think we got two more left. This is it. Last two. Last two gifts. And we're increasing viewers as we go. How do you like that? Tate. All right. I'm looking at the comments. What are the STP songs? No, I'm not looking at the comments. You missed it. Coffee. I can't believe I can't think of this going on my brain. Just... Pull out game strong. And it's like a fish hat. Nice boobers. Nice boobers. All right. Oh, nice boobers. I think that's it. Nice little nice boobers hat for the little clash action. Uh, let me do the one sweep to make sure I didn't miss anything. Uh, 
No. We did it. All right. That uh wraps up the unboxing seven. What a roller coaster. Uh this will be the one that everyone's like, what happened? What's the what's the highlight? Low late. You know, I really you can almost see it dark again because it's getting all the blood. So that was vicious. Um, that board I don't like. But overall, you know, we're getting through it. Tomorrow's Easter. So happy Easter to all you Easter people. Happy Passover to all the Passover people. Um, and we will have no boxing tomorrow because the mail doesn't work on Sunday. So day off for me. Uh, and again, I prefer not to keep getting these presents. So... Uh, you know, I do open them, but if you have unique shit, fine. As long as quarantine's going on, we'll be the unboxing king. My chest hair is fucking phenomenal.